Okay, looks good, everybody. Looks good. I think we're all good to play the game. We're gonna do some more Yu-Gi-Oh! Yep, it's actually recording. No worries this time. And I think we'll start by going down over here. We've got the hero stuff still set up with Aster. We're trying to finish off his, um, his playthrough and see if we can start Cyrus's today. Yeah, let's go with you. They're the only characters here, aside from the ones at the, the front gate. We gotta save up some points. You excited to play Machines, everybody? And because we got four hearts with him, we do we were able to edit his stuff last time. Stream is messing up for you. Try hitting refresh. Seems to be working just fine on my end. Let's see. It says I haven't dropped any frames. Okay, nice. He's got Necro Shade to discard, and he's gonna discard Dasher. That's fine though. By the way. You know how the whole point of this card is to get revived, right? He actually will not use Premature Burial on it. We noticed that. It's really silly. Okay, this is good. We'll put this down. Don't do that. We'll put you in defense mode. Activate the effect of Ocean. No, that's okay. And we'll throw down the Skyscraper. Can I poly anything? I cannot. Hmm... He put down Mirror Force and Call the Haunted. I'm gonna put down Wild Heart. And I say we go for the attack. We don't have to worry about battle traps with Wild Heart here. I hope. Oh, it's Giant Rat. At least I had just enough points to beat it. Okay. We'll hit this right here. Blast with Chain, okay. I still beat him because of Skyscraper. Great, great activation there, buddy. Huh. That was great. Um, yeah, there are video games that go up to the X XCs era. There's, um, there's Legacy of the Duelist, but there's only, like, one Zexel game, and it's on 3DS. I don't know if it's any good or not. I think it was only released as download only. I kind of wanted to play it once I finished the Zexel anime. Mmm, I feel like I should set this just in case. I don't know if I want to revive Dasher, because he's going to have his annoying effect anyway. I'll leave this as is. I'm not even sure if you actually play real Yu-Gi-Oh in that one. Oh, that sucks. Is it one of those ones with, like, the fake Yu-Gi-Oh mechanics? I don't think I've heard anyone talk about it. Discard one card at random, destroy one monster. Ah, uh, you know what? Take a random card from my hand. I'm keeping my wall up. Well, so much for that. At least we can beat over in this turn. And no, wait, we lost Skyscraper. He's gonna add Dasher back. He's gonna use King of the Swamp, get Polly. And he's gonna fuse. Yes, yes. Now we're talking. Nice. He's gonna tribute that for Dasher. I thought he was gonna tribute Wild Edge for an attack beat stick. That would have upset me so much. Dasher is just. Dasher is basically Speed Warrior before Speed Warrior existed. Then Speed Warrior was super weaker. Okay, let's put you to attack mode again. We'll put you down. And we're gonna hope that nothing bad happens when I attack. Nothing, chat. Nothing. Good. We got him. We win, everybody. Sick. Game audio looking good. Sounding good, everybody. 877, not bad. Duelist bonus is pretty good for these two. Okay. But heck, that was loads of excitement. That was awesome. Nice. All right, let's go again if they give such a good bonus. This might be the last time for a bit I get to play Heroes. It was fun to revisit them, but we had to jump through a lot of hurdles with Aster to get him to work. Wasn't it last time I played this, Aster did, like, so many, like, hilarious fumbles? Like, he kept trying to revive Booster. Or, sorry, Captain Gold. 
I keep doing it. I'm not doing it on purpose, I swear. He kept trying to revive him without Skyscraper on the field. The AI just doesn't acknowledge that side effect or requirement, I should say. Oh, nice. Opening Stratos. I never get my ease anymore. Okay, there we go. He's bringing the heat. Now here comes another germ and another. We should get this. Uh-oh. That's a problem. That's a big problem. What have you just left me with? Fantastic. Okay. Let's turn this way and destroy. I, I can't destroy it by effect. I need to, like, kill it via Skyscraper's effect. Hang on a second. 1,500. Oh, I can do it, and he can't Battle Trap in response. This is actually really good. Hang on. Hang on. First, I gotta activate your effect. Okay. I might need to... It might be better to save Stratos so if they don't flip up anything. I really need my normal summon, and I need immunity to the trap cards. So I'm gonna put down Wild Heart. Hmm. That's not to set anything. I'm gonna go to battle phase. Nice. Wild Edge doesn't keep the effect where it's immune to trap cards. I wish it did. It loses its edge, ironically. Okay, now that we've done that... I'm worried about... I don't think he'd Heavy Storm with three cards back there, so I'm gonna put both these down. And I'll save this for when I have more heroes in Stratos next turn. That Phoenix getting out was really worrying. I'm glad I... <sighs> Chat. I... I could swear it would've- it was a safe bet. I could swear! They never do that when there's this many back row for them. Well, that sucks. I don't want to lose Stratos. This sucks. Wait a second. This shouldn't- th this shouldn't affect Wild Heart, right? Oh my god, it doesn't. Oh, that's awesome. Except I'm hit anyway. <laughs> Come on, buddy, you can do it. He's going Miracle. Yes, he's making Wild Edge. Attaboy. Attaboy, come on. Throw down the Stratos. And what's he gonna do? He's gonna take Dogma. Uh, okay then. That sucks. And he's not gonna attack Nidori. He's gonna let it die anyway. Well, this sucks. Yep, yeah, game over. Man, I almost had the comeback after that Phoenix, but it got botched after that. I really didn't think they'd throw down a heavy storm in that situation. No, no, no. No, no, no. Rematch, Maki. Rematch. Welcome, Fuzzy. How you doing? Maki's a Sundari, of course she is. Everyone is, apparently. Oh, pardon me. I feel like I'm holding back a sneeze. All right, I can't talk, let me repeat that. I feel like I'm holding back a sneeze all of a sudden. Let me get a drink. Okay, I got that mirror force ready. Oh, now I got the heavy storm. Hmm. I'm gonna do it. Apparently it was a good call. It was that stupid card again. With the call of the haunted. Hmm. I'm gonna do this to get myself my skyscraper. Okay, we'll take that. Um... 
I suppose I may as well put you down and search. For now, probably best I just take Blade Edge. In case I draw a poly. Now we'll go into attack. Oh, it's Wall of Illusion? Disgusting. At least I killed it. If I were to attack with Stratos, I'd be regretting this play very hard. Alright. I still got resources. We're okay. We're okay, chat. We are okay somehow. Oh? Well, you got the Wild Edge instead. Another Stratos. They're never gonna pop the back row. Ever. Oh, good thing you added that blade edge to your hand. Ooh, the recruit beat stick. Now you can't do anything to stop us. Okay, I just had to mute and actually sneeze there. I'm okay, chat. Streamer's alive. That's a lot of cards back there. And both Stratos are out, so... Hmm... Let's just take a card. Voice crack there, jeez. Hmm. I could go for the slow burn kill with heat. <laughs> no, am I kidding? That won't, it's silly. Take this as backup if I need a monster set. For now, we're gonna go for the kill. Yeah, I thought so. Let's go for it. Nidoria. Yeah, we know what's happening now. Really? You targeted the one... Or wait, no. You don't get the target, right? Destroying one... Okay, you do get to choose the monster. Why you... wouldn't you kill the one that didn't attack then? Weird. Well, we know it's safe now. There's nothing else we can do, though, so we'll end the turn. Your rabbit was sneezing, too? Aw, poor little bunny. Okay, go for it. Heavy storm, bro. Heavy storm. You got it. You got this. D d no! What? Huh? Huh? Dude. Dude. A activate the heavy storm. What's wrong with you? Do you have any idea how unsafe that was? And now you put down Blade Edge. And now you put down Blade Edge. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, very pro-duelist play right there. Do you see what I have to put up with, folks? Do you see this? I do. Oh, if only I had a card to deal with that entire back row there, huh? At least we know there's probably not battle traps anymore. Well... Hmm. If I make Wild Edge... Hang on, I have an idea. I have an idea. First... Where is he? Make Wild Edge, and we're gonna use King of the Swamp and Blade Edge in my hand for it. So I can have a Wild Heart on the field, just in case there's, like, some kind of trap card that botches everything. All right, now we go ahead and let you take out everything. You lose, you literally lose, I don't care. Great play. She took me out with her. If she can't have the victory, no one can. She took me out Yandere style. 849, I almost said 41 and caught myself there. I pity you, so come to me if you need an opponent. Don't get any funny ideas. It's not like I want to duel you. Our win. Keep it up. E. We already talked to the cat at the end of last episode. No problem. I pity you, so you know. Girls dorm? Have I checked here for opponents? What are you two doing here? Uh, we need my 10th victory with him. Let's do it. Remember when guys weren't allowed near the girls' dorm? Neither does this series. 
This is the longest team up I've had so far, yeah. I mean, Chaz had his issues, but he was still fun. Aster is just, like, he doesn't know how to use the cards that he can't get rid of. He has to run Disc Commander, but he won't revive it. He doesn't understand why it's even there. He'll always revive a stronger monster because he thinks that's the play he needs to do. Ah, damn. Okay, they went minus for that. Oh, both Skyscrapers for once. Not bad. Crush cards there. Hmm. I'll put Ocean, because if it survives, we can get Heat back from the graveyard next turn. Nothing we confuse, so I say we just attack, bait the battle traps. Yeah, that's fine. At least the Sakuretsu is used up now instead of when I had a fusion. Pyramid Turtle's the only thing poking me, not a bad not bad at all. You didn't win, sweetie. I I lost. That's her excuse. Oh! Yes, he's gonna go for Blade Edge. Assuming there's not another Sakuretsu there. Wait, is Sakuretsu at one? I don't think it is. Well. Went minus just to get bottomless. At least Stratos here. Remember, when you're feeling lost, Stratos can always find you. No matter where you are. Uh-oh. Next Exile Force are gonna kill me. He's putting another turtle on board. Okay, Ceasefire should be okay for this. I can Miracle from the Graveyard. I could make another Blade Edge and hope it works this time. I say go for it. Let's do it. That was profound. Yes. Okay, we'll put these guys in. Let's hope it works this time. Okay. No Sakuretsu? Good. And we can attack everyone once each, because Blade Edge just has that edge. Or sorry, Wild Edge. I love how how the computer opponents do not know how to use Exiled Force. They keep setting it. Instead of realizing it's basically a trade to pop a monster. Um alright, that looks fine. We'll end it here. Is the nightmare with Aster ending today? I hope. Nice. He's going Storm. Okay. You can win. You can win. No Karibo in hand? We're good. Okay. My, I've never been so humiliated. What a wonderful duel. Let's play again. Okay, not bad. We should try and do a tournament with Aster this weekend. Maybe with the hero deck, he won't botch it like he did the last time. Didn't he, like, blow it on the first duel when we did that? I think he did. We can get some more points from the dungeon as well. Six Samurai, Masked Army. I never really duel this guy. He's almost never around. He's a Slifer, but he's level 8. Oh, by the way, I almost forgot to talk about this chat. Um... I finally did start reading the uh, the original Yu-Gi-Oh! manga. First to go. I said I wanted to make time to read stuff, and I've been doing that for the last few nights. Like the original, original Yu-Gi-Oh! manga. Before it was about dual monsters. And you guys weren't kidding. That, that crap is really unhinged and silly. It is not for kids. Yeah, you're telling me. I have, like, the little, like, omnibus volumes where it's, like, a little big book that has three volumes in one. So I technically have the first six volumes of the original manga. Ah, oh, damn it. Okay, that sucks. To give you an idea of how silly it is, right? The literal second second chapter, you know what happens? A news crew shows up at Yugi's high school, and 
they need to get foot they're doing a special on school bullying so you know what they do they have one of the one of the crew dress up in a high school uniform and they just find yugi and they beat him up to get footage and then the pharaoh gets awakened and he finds the producer and he he makes it the producer play a game where he's like hey you have to roll a, uh, a lower number than me on this dice and yugi rolls a six and the producer rolls his die the die splits in half into two halves that are that one side says one and one side says six so he said and yugi's like okay you rolled a seven you lose and also you're blind now and he blinds the guy he literally blinds him for life and that's the end of the chapter <laughs> that's Yu-Gi-Oh. before it was about the card games <laughs> it's so silly I'm 10 chapters in, and he's set two people on fire as well. Well, he doesn't blind him, but he makes it so the dude can only see, like, TV sensors on everything. So he's ba he's basically blind, legally, I would say. Anyways, let me go ahead and search you out. We're gonna thin the deck by getting Skyscraper out. Hang on. That's right. Yami Yuki, he set a guy on fire, and he, he set another guy on fire, but with an explosive. It's so silly. Oh, boy. Anyways, what the hell is this thing? I should check it now. Wait, control six and the bad. Need choice card. Any monster this card attacks at the end of the damage step. Let's see. Be destroyed, you can destroy another six samurai instead. All right, that's fine. It's got 1,800. Darn, this is all I got? Hmm. It might be best to crash him into into him, I wonder. Because I can't do the skyscraper effect with a tie. Hmm. I'll do it though, hang on. At an effect here. He still does it a few times in Duelist Kingdom. Oh boy, does he ever. Hmm. I'll take you. Uh, this might be an overreaction, but I'm gonna crash these two into each other. There we go. Grand Tiki Elder. Yeah, you know what? You can keep that. Do this. He doesn't say Mind Crush in the manga. He says Penalty Game. Some of the games are really silly, but, like, also, like, kind of creative. Like, that one with the dice was just stupid, and, and it's only, like, a few panels long. But some of them are really unhinged. Like, one guy who sets up, like, a big grill at the school festival, Yugi, like, puts an explosive inside of a block of ice, and he makes the guy play a game with him where they're knocking the ice snap back and forth across the grill, and whoever has it melt and explode on them is the loser. And it's like, okay, that's, that's a little messed up, but all right. Let's see, if it'll be destroyed, Troy this, this card instead. Damn, two polys like this. What a pain. All I can do is do that. As soon as I hit attack mode, I realized my skyscraper was gone. Oops. <laughs> oh, well. Kaiba's penalty game was the mind crush. Yami saying mind crush all the time is just a meme. Okay. Hot potato air hockey. Yes. Yeah, Yugi, Yugi like, uh, threw the bomb at a freaking high schooler because he was a bully. I mean, mean, to be fair, the bullies in that series are also unhinged. All right, get us out of our mess here, Aster, because I didn't pick the right searches. The six samurai guy is really no joke, just because he's a slifer. Yeah, we got bodied by him pretty hard. He wet my skyscraper and was all over for me. Farewell for now. Oh yeah, someone, I'm pretty sure like the 10 chapters in that I've gotten through, um, people have tried to murder Yugi like maybe four or five times at this point. Okay, let's check in here. Let's go somewhere else then, why don't we? Let's go to the dual field. 
And then we'll prepare to do some dungeon crawling, if we can call it that. What about you two? Cryo Sphinx. This, the Cryo Sphinx dude is everywhere, no matter where I go. Yeah, let's get your 10th victory. Okay. Bullying in manga is, is kind of unhinged, yeah. Some of, the, some of those people are just straight-up psychos. I think that was, like, kind of the culture, though. Like, in, in fiction, I mean. Like, because I think, like, a lot of 80s manga, it was all about, like, you know, the tough guys, the school fights, and everyone just being, like, so freaking unhinged. That's kind of like why a lot of 90s series just kind of, like, depict their the, the school bully like that, from what I understand. All right. Everybody's a tough guy. They got to get in fights. Even though they're, like, in eighth grade. Well, we're getting hit by the familiar possessed girl. Okay. I could use swords to stall. Hmm. I'd still be too weak to fight you. Yeah, I think I'll stall for a little bit. Oh, no! You know what I should have did? I was gonna set Clayman, but I just realized I could have set you. And then you'd be flipped face up. Hmm. Oh, wait, no opponent's side. Never mind. Never mind. <laughs> Streamer made a mistake. Everyone scream. Yeah, it's been so long since I got to read manga, man. It's 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 good to get back to it. I keep telling myself I have no time, but really, once you get into something, the chapters can just be so short, especially if it's a weekly series like OG Yu-Gi-Oh. You can just read it in like 10-15 minutes, even if you go slow. Alright, there goes Woodsman. Okay. Well, there goes that. And there goes that. That swords was a good play, me. Okay, here comes Asa. That is how you say it, right? Oh, nice! A free, a free heat special summon. That means I can put down the other heat. And we'll have enough attack power to beat over her. Let me see. Okay, we'll do this. Yeah, um, Kaiba actually shows up like nine chapters into the manga, but he it's like done very different from what people are used to. Like he wasn't even like a like a big corporation CEO. He's just a random guy in Yuki's class who like wanted the blue eyes. And this is before like the Exodia duel as well. The Exodia duel was not the first one. Damn. You can also tell that Kazuki Takahashi, he really wanted to draw that card game duel because he put so much effort into drawing the monsters, It's it, it was absurd. There we go. It's no wonder that that angle made the series a lot more popular because it's clear like he really wanted to do that part. And I haven't gotten to the depth T stuff. Well, good thing I got this. Don't get my skyscraper, so let's just put down Clayman for now. And wait. Exile Force? Oh, no. Wait, what? Um... I don't have a spellcaster. Hang on. Not yet. Hang on. Can't activate it now, can I? Yeah, let's do this. I think Kazuki Takahashi said in one interview he lucked into drawing the series he always wanted to draw without even knowing it. Thanks to how much the fans love the card game. That's good. There we go. I also like that Duel Monsters is called Wizards and Monsters. I guess this was before it, like, uh, has a name. Maybe it has a name change. You, you Don't tell me, obviously. Well, I can't beat over this thing. Ugh, oh, what a bad hand I keep getting. Another exiled force? Dude, come on! Didn't matter what I summoned in that case. These guys are bodying us. Come on, Aster. Yes, come on, you can do this, you can do this. 
Oh, that's not going to help. Yes. Okay, that helped. He has Blast Sphere. Watch out for set monsters on the other guy's hand. Alright, no problem. We got Skyscraper. Uh... Okay. Should be safe with Sparkman on board, though. And we can also activate this for the hell of it. We still have a chance of coming back here. Come on. Oopsie. Very delayed input for that. It took like five seconds for my menu to come up there. I don't know what was going on. All right, let's do it. There's a lot of like older Shonen Jump manga I did want to go back and read. I remember when I was a teenager, I would read like bits and pieces of it from like the little anthology magazine they had. But um, being a kid with no job, I didn't have money for that stuff. So obviously I couldn't buy it. Uh-oh, that's not good. Okay. He's tripping it for that. Not bad. Good idea. I'm glad he realized to do that, to be honest. Okay, but now that I'm an adult who has uh, the wonderful job of being a streamer, where, of course, I make a million dollars per second, of course, chat, I can afford all the mangoes I want. Hmm. We can burn him a little bit with Lady Heat. That's something. Nice. As a matter of fact, I'm sitting on a chair made out of, like, um, those big bags of money. You know, the ones with the big dollar signs on them? Uh-oh, that's not good. Well, so much for that. Dude, we're getting, like, destroyed lately. Play your damn heavy storm, come on. And now we don't have Skyscraper to beat over those. Wait, what? It... Huh? Huh? Did he seriously search out Clayman? And not a monster to hit these? Well, whatever. We still got a chance. We still got a chance. The Herman Miller Herman Miller Money on Chair. I don't know what that is. Um, damn. This won't get me anything. I can't fuse these two. Do I set you? If I set it, it's just gonna get destroyed. I have to hope they can't beat over Clayman. Aw, oh, man. Dude, what is my luck with these last few duels? We're getting destroyed. Come on. Oh, no, no! Thanks for getting rid of our only defense, buddy. Okay, now watch Necroshade die. Oh, I, you are so lucky we're not dead. I can't fuse you guys either. Okay. Let's see. Luckily, we're immune to these. I was so worried for a second. Holy crap. Uh, can we live? Can we live? Why do you get the destiny draw? Get out of here. Astra, put the swords down. Put the swords down. No, no. Great. Wait, I can make Wild Edge now. What am I worried about? Hang on, we might actually got this. Okay. Don't let this blow. Don't let this blow. Hmm. No shaman. Just need you. Holy crap, we might actually do this, chat. We might actually do this. I had a panic when he sacrificed Clayman for Necroshade. You're not supposed to actually put Necroshade on the field, Aster. We're lucky he didn't draw him a monster to quickly just tribute and beat over it. Let's start with these. Wait. Wait, do they get an effect for Earth? They gave the effect of a monster at this card destroyed, but... Oh, okay. 
That was silly of me. I didn't check to see if the attribute I played would uh, affect these guys. I'm lucky that nothing bad happened there. I almost ate, gar ate crap for that pretty hard. Oh, man. I'm surprised we won that. That was, that was a really silly back and forth. Curses. I'll be ready next time. He, Arwen. Super strength. Back to basics. What about you? Old ambition, not him. You know what? Let's let's duel you, Hyde. We don't duel you enough, apparently. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Oh boy. Hyde is good at hiding, yeah. Gotta duel everybody at the school. After this, we'll go to the dungeon for a bit. Man, already more than half hours gone by. Time absolutely flies. Okay, he can make Wild Edge. He's gonna turn one, play it. Is he gonna miracle a second? Now see, this is what his deck should be doing if he didn't have all those damn Destiny heroes in there. Yeah! Yeah! Oh. Well, he got Strato, so I'll give him that. Okay. Oh, nice! No, not nice! Okay, buddy. Here's what we're gonna do, then. Let's get rid of that other card you got there. Aha! That was a good call. Now then... Wait, I can make Inferno and set Clayman. Do I want Inferno? Lady Heat's kind of dead in my hand anyway. You know what? Why the hell not? I got rid of his negate for that. That means Aster will be able to miracle one on his turn. Yay. It was pretty common for Jade in the turn one two Wild Edges like that, to be honest. Okay, we'll do this. We'll do that. Yay! Now I can't win! Gillian's first turn. Yep, he's gonna do it. And Gillian plays water monsters, so this actually works good for Inferno. Nope, we win. Nothing too major, we've just been doing a little bit of dueling with Aster. Getting some points and getting some hearts for him. We're gonna see the end of his events as well. Nice. 861, damn. Okay. One and a half heart left to get for him. Now then. Let's go ahead and get out my dungeon deck. Yeah, there it is. No destiny card needed for that. Time for class. Yes, I'll go. Well, duh. You have to go to class, you know. Okay, the cut on, um, do you guys notice every time I'm on this screen, they, like, misaligned one of, um, Crowler's facial features? So, like, there's a giant slit on the top part of his, uh, his portrait, where there's just, like, a little straight, a straight line of pixels. You guys see that, right? Like, that's not an emulator thing. That, that, that's just straight up they misaligned one of his facial features when he smiles there. Because normally you just go, like, you... You don't change the whole portrait, you just load a little thing on top of it to simulate the blinking, too. It's so silly. Anyways, let's enter the basement. Okay. Looks like there's plenty of chests through this way. Sure, we'll take the long way around, why don't we? Let's 
Toad Master. The master of the toads. He's the one that commands they get a chain smoker voice in the GameCube era. Alright. Well then, let's start with this. Boop him for 500 and then hit him with the volcanic slicer. Hmm. Yeah, activate it on summon there. I can't remember if it's safer or not safer to activate this effect on the summon. Okay, get ladder. Enemy. Rapid fire magician. Each time, hang on. Each time you activate a normal spell card. Okay, so when they activate a normal spell card, I'm safe here then. Is it an emulator glitch? Oh, well then. I've seen quite a few incorrect, uh, incorrectly aligned sprites in this game. It wouldn't shock me. Did I just get Jinzo? Did you see that? Huh? Isn't that banned though? I don't think I can use it. Steamroid. Well then, let's hit him with three Rhyme A. Um, wait, Jinzo counts as a machine, right? I could put it in the deck I'm gonna make to play with Cyrus. Ooh. Might be limited. Anyways. Well, we'll just go forward then. No need to spend a ladder here. Yeah, let's do this then. way we'll heal the 500 we just took. You win! Easy. I haven't seen a single character in this game use Jinzo, and they used it non-stop in the previous one, so I can only assume it's because it's probably banned now or something. Oh, boy. Okay, it's just awesome. Bait the negate with this. Okay, now we hit him for the big blow. Deal damage to the opponent. Oh, boy. My headphones are slipping off, chat. Give me a second while I make an adjustment here. Okay, now I can go fast again. Jinzo's the dude that uh, negates all trap cards, yeah. Ukazi. Look at that. Amazing. Headless Knight. That one's a pretty meh card, I believe. I still haven't hit level 41. Hmm. Probably safer if I just use a tremendous fire this turn. Okay. Yes, I will negate. You will take the damage, buddy. And you will go down. Jinzo is limited or semi limited, but never banned. Okay. Isn't, like, uh, Malicious the only thing that's semi-limited semi now? Or is- it's the card that's always semi-limited, I guess. Because of, uh, how bad it is to have a three instead of two. Okay. Alright, let's go. Enemy. Let's hit him with this. He'll damage the opponent. 
He'll never see what gets him. Hmm. Found a ladder. This is fine. I don't think he can negate anything here. Easy hand to immediately win. Not bad. Hit him with that fireball. Fireball. Okay, perfect here. Ultimate Obedient Fiend. I've never had the battery actually run out. I'm never here long enough for that to even be, like, a thing. Draw phase, no problem. Hmm. You know what I could do is I could heal and then use Tremendous Fire. I'd still have... All right, never mind then. There goes that. Okay. We can still win this, but just in case, let me bait this. 500. I'll take the damage to play it safe. Okay, good. Fight this lad. I believe that winning theme was actually playing a lot more in Tag Force 1. Hmm. Let's do this. It should be okay. Hit him with that card. Hit him with the Ukazi. Enemy again. It's just going good, chat. It's going A-OK, -okay, in fact. Another one I can win in two plays. Easy. Oops. It's weird to imagine that cards like frickin' Sparks were even a real thing and meant to be taken seriously back in the day. No, Sparks was always just pack filler through and through, right? Pack filler is always a thing in any card game. They don't make every card with the idea that it's going to be, like, uh, genre... Like, not genre-defining, like, uh... Meta-defining. That's that's the term I'm looking for. I don't know why I said genre. Hmm. This is a bit of an issue. Don't really have the ones I want. I might get score more damage if I just sent you instead. Hmm. With any luck, I should win this turn. So let's do it. Okay. He MST'd that. It's good to bait it. Okay. Now we hit him for this. 1,000. Oh, nice. Before I win, let me just heal my life points back with Poison of the Old Man. Dude, stop that. He will not let me have that, for crying out loud. Get koala There you go. Found a rice ball. Go down. Alright, let me see what I got here. Let me focus. Go down here. Hmm. So if I want to continue up that way... Should go for the first ladder there, and then... Chest. Okay, that'll work. Barely got started here. Furthest I got was 50-something. But I'm breezing through it with my current cards. It's easy. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and bait his negate first. Hmm... I don't need to use Poison of the Old Man to heal. I'll be 100 below max at this point. Okay, we got him. Power capsule. Now we're just gonna run like this. 
Yu-Gi-Oh! is such a comfy time, isn't it? I've still, for the most part, can I since I started this like back in like what November, I've consistently been doing like one stream of it at least per week. It's been just that fun, and y'all just aren't tired of it. I appreciate that, everybody. Hang on, we can finish him with this now. Still, I gotta get around to starting some other Yu-Gi-Oh games, like I keep promising. We started quite a few things the past week, though, and I had a lot of fun. Um, I mentioned playing a game, Pokemon Recharged Yellow. I started that this week with the, uh, the PNG tuber. It was a very fun stream. The dev even tweeted about it after, which was nice. People got to see the Teddy Ursa button for the first time, and it was very wholesome. It also did extremely well. Use my Yu-Gi-Oh streams to sleep. Good, good. And we did, we finally did start the Mario Party CPU tournament. I did two boards last week, DK's Jungle Japes and Yoshi's Island. This Thursday, we're going to play Mario Party 2, and we're going to do Pirate Land, I think. All I do is just turn on... I, I set four computer players to play against each other, and we watch it for, like, two hours, and it's hilarious. <laughs> we had, like, tons of people there alive for it, too. It was great. All right. I was going to do some more... Hang on a second. Let me... Okay, this is a straight shot. Okay, we'll do this and put a ladder near the end. Okay. Okay. I also got to start Mother 3. However, there's a few copyright issues with trying to upload that because some of the music. So I have to... It's going to take me a little bit to get those actually going on YouTube. Luckily, the game's fun so far, so YouTube will get to enjoy it soon enough. Excellent. This week, I want to keep it pretty chill and relaxed. Um, Yeah, I'll do this. Maybe make it a, a week of short streams again. Today is a, we're going t slightly long, though, because I wanted to finish Paper Lily after Yu-Gi-Oh! today. Yeah, let's do this. Secret Barrel. Good, good, good. I didn't see what I got. I hit the button too early. Blaze Accelerator? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Don't. Don't. Don't burn me. That's my strategy. Hang on, let me do this, then Tremendous Fire for game. Oh, yeah, like, it's so important to play some play and read stuff on your own. I'm learning that lately. Some There are times where I'll be up at, like, uh, 11 to midnight still making thumbnails and I'm just being like, no, I gotta get this done when I should just go to frickin' bed or be doing something fun before bed. You gotta cut yourself off from work hours if you can. Hard to do that when you're, you're your own boss now. Okay, we're doing that. Go for the Goblin Thief and Tremendous Fire to negate my back damage here. This is good. And we're going to do sub-goals next month. I'm still making big plans for that. We I don't remember if we mentioned it during the last Tag 4 stream, but um, we were thinking of adding uh, a replay of Reshef of Destruction. Make it one of the many games I replay with my PNG tuber, because it's been like six or seven years since I played it. <laughs> that could be fun. Maybe just call those streams, like, PNG Tuber Edition or something. And down the line, eventually, I can buy the model chat. Um... I'm gonna go for the safe bet and win the game here. Why would I subject myself to Reshef again? For views, of course. Probably won't use it for uh, the false bound, no. I don't need to use it for every single game. I just use it when I think it'll be fun. Okay. Okay, the guys have a slightly more teal jacket, so... I think we can leave with this floor. Do it.
Gonna pop you with this. Just hit him with the little burns and we're done. I've been promising that false bound Yugi playthrough for like over a year. I <laughs> just haven't gotten to it yet. Another one I like, uh, mostly full screen games where I feel like it would be too awkward to stick it in the corner. Like I wanted to play Hacker's Memory this year because I played Cyber Sleuth last year. I feel like I can just do Cyber Sleuth without it. Excellent. Okay, do it for this. During Spirit Tracks, I talked about play it, using it for all the Paper Mario games because I wanted to. Okay, do this. Restore my life points back to full. Perfect. Now that's exciting. Be, uh, the misery of a YouTuber gets views. Yes, it does. And the happiness of YouTuber also gets views as well. You'd be surprised how many people have, have told me that since I've used the PNG tuber, they tell me those seem like the most fun streams because I'm just having a good time. And I really pretty much am. It's funny because um, I think I showed like a little graph to the Discord the other night, right? Like a little a little graph that shows like how many subscribers you, you've gained. I usually don't pay attention to that stuff, but I got curious and I looked at it. And it shows for all of February. It's just like a little, you know, a little squiggly line that goes up and down like normal. And then you get to the week that I started using the PNG tuber, and there's just like a massive spike upward. And I just posted that, and I'm like, hey guys, can you guess when I started using this? <laughs> I thought that was hilarious. All right, there we go. Now we do this right here. Finish off his 10 remaining life points. Damn money. There we go. People love their little anime. Yes, they do. 99% of people love it. Every once in a while, I get the odd comment that's really pissed off about it, but like, well, oh well. That's pretty much expected when you start using the little anime character. Hi, Mina. How you doing? I'm playing the Yu-Gi-Oh's. Um, even if you attack me, this should be safe. So I'm gonna do this. Okay, go for it. Flip the secret barrel. Oh, it probably will wear out fast. Any surge of views from anything new. That's, that's just the game. Return above ground. High score bonus. Or sorry, no, there's no high score bonus for this. That's a lot of DP, but meh. You're free to go. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Any any shiny new toy wears off after a little bit. It's YouTube. You will be forgotten about a week later. That's just YouTube. These guys. Um, you know what? Let's let's try dueling them. This is a bad idea, but let, that's why we should do it. I need a drink. My throat is getting dry from all my talking. Oh, there we go. Break out the PNG tuber with the Teddy Ursa Kigurumi. I was thinking of getting some more outfits commissioned from Verdi. You know what I was thinking from the Mario Party 2 streams? What if I give my character a little accessory when, depending on the board. Like, you know how the characters dress up in Mario Party 2? What if I give myself a little pirate hat when we play the pirate board? Or a little wizard hat when we play the Horrorland board? I need a drink. You're right. Let me do it again. I still have my burn deck set. Oops, I didn't change it. Oops. <laughs> Oops. Um. All right, then. I was too caught up talking about my Animu character. Wombat protects us. Yeah, we got Sparks, chat. What's he gonna do? What's he gonna do about it? Yeah, yeah, you got nothing, bro. You got no answer for this. It's Sheriff Asprey. Drop all that honey you stole there, partner. 
Think you could just walk into town and take all that honey away from the teddies? Don't think so. All right, we can do this. Let's do this now. Come on. Did I? Oh, Royal Decree did that. Of course it did. All right, we're getting booped. We've probably lost this because I forgot to take out my real deck. Heavy Storm, bro. You can do it. He put down Dasher. Oh, boy. And turn ends. Oh, I got him with the final flame, everybody. What do I think of Rumble? I have no idea what that is, friend. No! Did it... Oh, did I bring up the freaking circle menu? I went to I went to put him into attack mode and I hit the button to bring up that instead. God damn it. Well then, Dasher's dead. Good job, me. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, wait. He destroyed it via effect anyway. It wouldn't have made a difference. Backfire. Yeah. Yeah. Use Ring of Destruction, Aster. Nice. We're still winning. We're still winning. Oh, I did it, chat. Destiny Draw Sparks. Let's go. Well, nothing to do but defend. If we win this. Oh no, don't refresh my hand. Don't refresh the burn player's hand. Anything but that. Okay, he's going for the attack. I need Astra to stall one more turn. Come on. You can do it. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. Is he making Necroid Shaman? Oh my god, he is. What's his game plan? Bring the jar back? Why would you bring that back? No! Um... Uh-oh. 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 Uh-oh! <laughs> we lose! We just lose! Just barely. Oh, we were close. Damn. Just about what I was expecting. All right, let me get my real cards out. Aster cost us again. Yes, he did. Why did he bring back the fire monster? Like, the jar was literally right there. Uh, I'm the one who brought the wrong deck, and he still blew it. Could have had Dasher in attack mode earlier, though. I, I misinputted that. I had sparks in my deck. Clearly, it was Astra's fault. I'm the one who knows what I'm doing. <laughs> Alright, rematch, bro. He brought the wrong deck. I made it for him, though. <laughs> I did more damage than him that duel. Yes, I did. All right. New duel. Let's go. He's activating Polly. Turn one. Lord of D. To make King Dragon. Oh, boy. Do something about it, Aster. Come on. Come on. He's playing that. He's gonna search. For Dogma. He really, really needs to have Dogma in his hand at all times. I 
I built his deck, but he refuses to let me change the worst cards in it. Blaze Accelerator. Molten Destruction. Okay. Hang on. Let's see. Cannot select any drag type monsters of the target of spell, trap, or monster effects. Once per turn, you can special summon one dragon monster from your hands. Okay. This doesn't target, though. Hmm. Let's try this. Nice. And next, we'll do this. Hmm. Let me see. Do I want to pop one card or just go for the attack? We have swords. I think I can wait. So let's do this. Nope. Attack you first. Can't ta I can't change a good chunk of his Destiny Heroes. This includes some that he doesn't even know how to use. When he gets out Dogma, it's hype, but it's not consistent at all. Thank goodness I can take out Dreadmaster. Dreadmaster, he literally doesn't even know how to summon the damn thing. It's it's infuriating. Luster Dragon, no problem. Oh, Aster. Oh, Aster. Yeah, let's get rid of uh let's get rid of the trap immune card to get 100 more attack points. Good play, my dude. Good play. Now I get mattered, I guess. I guess he did get Necro Shade in the graveyard. I can't say he didn't. Scatter shot does not look right. My turn. Hmm. Okay, let's do this. Hmm. In case things go south, I'll get you to defend. First, let's see if I can finish you off. Damn! Nice. 787. Not bad. Ha! Ah, quite the crafty opponent. He, our win. How about you two? I love T-Rex too. Sure, a duel, no problem. The other Dino Duelist. And Hasselberry blew it with her. We've dueled so many opponents in this game. I should probably check my stats and see how many duels I've done through the total of this series. Machine King 2. Everyone has level 2 decks when your partner has 4 or more hearts. I think the prompt for it is once, um... You're, you're, you see the cutscene that your partner lets you edit their deck. Dinos and Machine King. Ah, there it goes. There's a Mirror Force. We're gonna go ahead and destroy the jungle to build civilization. Never mind. The space typhoon negates. Hmm. Maybe Sarasaurus is down. This is better when there's extra deck plays to make with it, but hmm. Let me emergency call. You know what I could do, actually? Hang on. Instead of getting Stratos, I told you, we are building that Skyscraper. Excellent. Where the big bag, big bad money bags destroying, the, destroying nature to build a Skyscraper, chat. Can you believe it? Okay. You see... That reminds me of a Harvest Moon game I want to try sometime. I don't know if it's any good, though, because it was only on the PSP. Let me see. I think it's called Hero of Leaf Valley. The premise is that, like, 
some like corporation wants to come to town and build like an amusement park and you have to just like save up enough money to stop it. Let me see. But I remember one of the gimmicks is that like you can actually mar marry um, the mean CEO that wants to build the amusement park. But amusement parks are fun. But what about nature? There we go. Entirely my reason for wanting to stream it was because I feel like that would be hilarious to just marry the evil CEO girl. It's basically a sequel to Save the Homeland. Yeah, isn't Save the Homeland the one on PS2? I think you can't even, like, marry in that game, though. Um... No, I don't want to do that. I'm gonna do this. And... Hmm... It's gonna refresh my hand anyway. We'll do this. Snuffkin will tear it, tear it apart. Marry your way out of your problems like a medieval royalty. <laughs> yeah. Okay, we discarded you. So what can we make? What can we make? Make terra firma. And that's it. Damn. Well, may as well go for it. Let's do it. Yeah, do that. I do, I do want to do more streams of the Harvest Moon games, but one of the biggest demotivators was the issue with Rune Factory 3, where there's that guy basically running the goddamn scam and you can't even upload Rune Factory 3 anymore. I'm hoping I can... St I, I recorded a, a stream of that a few months ago, and I'm still trying to get it uploaded. When I can, I can, chat. I'm hoping they just give up and piss off at some point, but like, man, what a pain, right? All right, let's go for the attack. Let me see. Just in case this thing can get strong. No. All right, then. That's all you did. Popped. Main phase two. I would love to continue it, Fuzzy. And play the other Rune Factory games, but... Har other Harvest Moon. Okay. Okay. Harvest Moon, Story of Seasons, Stardew Valley mods. I want to do a lot of those, especially with the PNG. Hang on. We'll cylinder you for this one. Yeah, I kind of want to play the crusty Harvest Moons that um, Natsume made after they stopped translating the games. One of those so bad, let's enjoy it streams. Okay. Let's go for it. My favorite, of course, is Mineral Town. I wanted to do uh, restream the original and its remake sometime with a stupid long series, because heck yeah, we can. Okay, I think Aster's gonna go for the kill. Oh? Oh. Oh. Let him cook, he's going! If he tributes everything on Terra Firma, I swear. I swear. I swear if he does that. He didn't. He didn't. Kill him. Oh, look at him. He actually played right. Look at him go. He won't tribute to buff Terra Firma. I'm so proud of him. All right. And over here, we've got Blair and you again. 17. I fought him 17 times. Probably because of the cutscenes, yeah? Nothing back here I can get. Baby Aster's first win. Let's go to the store. I know about Innocent Life. That's the futuristic Harvest Moon. That one didn't catch on like Rune Factory did. Let's do it. Caviar sandwich. All right, fancy boy. You like caviar? Yeah, he does. Can't marry in that one, yeah. Any Harvest Moon or Story of Seasons where you can't marry is doomed. It's like, you know that's like half the reason everyone wants to play it. Ooh, comfy farm life. Comfy farm life. I can't marry someone? What's the point? What's the point? I'm gonna die alone. But you're a robot? Yeah, that doesn't stop other works of fiction from letting the robot marry. Let's do that. Who wants to play a life sim where you're destined to die alone? 
Come on, you gotta appeal to the weeb fantasy. There we go. Parent sandwich. 500. No gold. You like pineapples? You better. Oh, come on, Aster. We saved up all these points just for you. I see a card. There we go. Ultimate Insect 7. Magical Dimension. Vanity's Fiend. Here, have it. Yay. Yeah, I know Stardew Valley got an update. One of the plans we're working on is, um, I'm gonna play the Stardew Valley Expanded mod with the new update as a, as a super long stream. But, um, some mods and friends are trying to make a little mod where they can make my character look like my PNG tuber for the stream. That's what I'm gonna do. I think that would be super awesome. Okay, tomato. I hear that Stardew Valley Expanded is is a mod so large, it basically could be its sequel on its own. And I'm pretty sure Concerned Ape, like, they gave the updates to, to modders like that early so that they can actually update the mods to be compatible. Pretty wild. Spicy fish egg sandwich. Excellent. Let's do this. No gold sandwich, damn. Come on, bro, let's just max out the heart and be on with our day. Got the card again. Swarm of scarabs, swords of brilliant light, and a scapegoat. Wait a second! I need scapegoat! Well, I needed it for a certain deck before, but now I don't. That was one of the minigame only packs, right? Well, that's good to have, maybe. All right. Can use it when it comes up, I guess. Come on, man, you're close. So much points required. Nice, three in a row. I'm doing better with this today. Of course I get garbage like this garbage. Eh, that one's okay, depending on the cards. Ah, uh, one more little push. Damn, I missed it. It's no giant turtle that feeds on flames, though. Okay. Looks like he's pretty good. Hang on, I should check my record. I said I would. Should be able to do his next event when we wake up tomorrow. Status. I have... Let me see here. I have won 541 duels, lost 111, and 7 ties. That seems a little absurd that there's been 7 ties. 7 too many. That's a lot of dueling in this game alone. Holy crap. How long do you plan on keeping me out? So we can do his next event, and then we can try the tournament with him. Someone on the island said they saw Sartorius. Let's go together, straight to the Society of Light. All right, let's make a save. Ooh, let me get a drink here. Oh boy. Double heroes with Aster is fun. He's at the blue dorm. Hmm, looks like we have more visitors. Huh? What do you want, Aster? Take me to Sartorius. Where is he? Boy, don't we get all fiery when talking about Sartorius. Sartorius! Sartorius! I know you can hear me. I saved you time and time again. And to do it again, I'll get rid of any obstacle in my way. So if you beat me in a duel, I'll let I'll to let you pass. How about a tag duel? You have enough guts to challenge us both? Ha! You're the ones that don't know how to tag duel. Aster, Aster, come on, come on. Let's not embarrass ourselves, come on. 
I brought along Asprey as my main duelist because I can't do it. It looks like I have the upper hand. Time to show you the light. Let's do this, Asprey. Let's show them what we got. Aster is not someone who should brag about knowing how to tag duel. <laughs> he should not. Uh, didn't Jaden have to save Sartorius? Because Aster couldn't do it. Yeah. Uh, White Chaz Rev. All right. But he's a pro. Yeah, he's pro. We just don't know at what yet. It's clearly not dual monsters. Clearly, I'm a pro at Yu-Gi-Oh. I'm good at the game. Alright, let's throw this down. Bait the negate. Yep, I thought so. Hmm. Ring of Destruction's here. I'm gonna do this. Get my Stratos. I'm gonna put Stratos down. And a card from my hand from my deck. No, 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 not that. Oops. That would have been real bad if I activated that. Okay. Probably best to leave you face down. Don't have a way to cover for this. Hmm. But if I can keep this up, Astra can get a free poly. Do I risk it? And use the Ring of Destruction to attack, to bop whatever goes for him? I think I will, to be honest. I'm gonna do it. But next turn, I mean. Leave it. Oh, of course it was that. You got an MST. Yeah. Yeah, I could have gone for the attack. You know what? Fine. Fine. Whatever. I missed out on a thousand extra damage, but it's whatever. Wait, I can Miracle right now? What? Huh? Oh, Terra Firma. Yeah, I, I, I could. <laughs> um, I didn't think about that, to be honest. Hmm. I don't need to yet. I'm gonna risk it. I'm gonna risk getting Astra the Poly and pretend it helps. Okay, we'll do this. Now Woodsman will be safe. Okay, nice. Aster, he already had a poly anyway. And he doesn't need it. Whatever, I regret nothing. He tributed Stratos for that? Whatever. Well, I tried my best. I don't regret anything. Yeah, let's do this. So much for that, Ben. Don't worry. We can still do this. We're tied right now, so we're good. Call the Haunted? Ah, damn, you're gonna bring that back, huh? That's the case. We'll pop you here. You're still down resources, so we're okay. Premature Burial. Saving my miracle for something better now. He really wants this thing on the field. Phantom Beast Rock Lizard. Uh, hold up. Distributing a Phantom Beast monster. This be, 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 be. When this card destroys a monster by battle, when this card destroys to the graveyard, bring your opponent's card effect, deflect to and damage your opponent. Um. Still probably best to get rid of it with Mirror Force, yeah. Still best. I'll take it. Come on. He's gonna put down Diamond Dude. He didn't get it. At least we can put the smack down on Chaz here. This is okay. So close. Hmm. We should be able to just attack for game with a uh, wild heart. You piece of trash. Apparently not. 
Okay, no need to make terra firma. I'll just set woodsman as a backup plan. Don't worry. We've been going for a little bit, but there's still plenty of the stream left. Oh, that's not good. Darn, darn, darn. We're doing Yu-Gi-Oh! for a few hours, and then I was going to finish Paper Lily today. That was the RPG Maker stuff. Now, Threatening Roar affects the player, so... Wild Heart still can't attack in that case. Uh-oh. Well, that's not good. That's really, really not good. Hmm... I can make Thunder Giant. Let me double check Thunder Giant's effect, because I always forget. Why is he gonna be at the end? With original attack less than Okay, I can pop Gazelle then. For Stinatrix and wait. Best I could make is Rampart Blaster, because I don't hmm. Who's in the graveyard right now? Wild Heart, Woodsman, Stratos. Ah, wait, no, Swamp's in there? Oh. That's the case. Hmm. If I throw down Spark Man, I can make Thunder Giant for that, which would probably be the best play. Hmm. Double check this. Okay. No problem. Need Thunder Giant for its effect. So let's do this. Okay. Now we'll activate its effect. Okay, there goes that. And I win. Oh, that was almost worrying. Had to make sure I do that right. Ah, we lost again. Now you guys can't get in my way. Where's Sartorius? Somewhere in the storm? He's not here. No one knows where he is. Ah, Sartorius, I'll save you. Looks like we're going here. What? Huh? Who the hell are these people? Uh, Sans Yudai Yuki. Darn it, of all the bad luck in the world, I get stuck with you. Tell me about it. Uh, Emperor Umi Uma. You're the last person I'd ever want to tag duel with. Hey, it's Asprey, good timing. Duel us. I don't want to be this chump's partner. There's a rule that you can't get a new partner without dueling at least once. For someone as dumb as you, that's a good idea, but let's at least try to win. Duh, every duel should be to win. Okay, here we come. Who are these people? Who are these people? They're clearly parody names, but I don't know who the hell they are. Yeah. Do they have custom animations? I should probably check this. Hold up. Kaiba can mean seahorse in Japanese, and Umi Uma is also sea horse in Japanese, but with a space between them. Okay. Hang on. Let's turn on animations to see these guys. Uh, on. Make sure it stayed. Okay. Maybe they don't have an animation. They probably don't, to be honest. It'd be funny if they were modeled for this, but I kind of doubt it. Is there some in-joke that I'm unaware of? Like, who who are they? <laughs> oh. Uh-oh. 
Uh oh. Okay, and I am back, everybody. So all of a sudden, Twitch just decided to disconnect the stream, and I was trying to reconnect it for like a good while here. It looks like we're finally back. Um, it wasn't my internet because I could still see chat the whole time as as chat was viewing the stream going down. It looks like it's finally stable now. I don't know what happened. It didn't seem like anyone else was affected. That was really strange. Anyways, I turned on animations. Let's actually see what these guys look like. I don't even remember what the hell was in my hand here. I was just distracted by that whole bit. Anyways. This is turn three. Hmm. You know what I could do, actually? Now I don't have a fusion for that, so... I'm gonna do this. Since we can attack this turn, I'm gonna make Terra Firma. Okay, let's do it. Pop him. Grab the king. Grab Mr. Ocean. Now I push this down. Okay. I'm not gonna activate any effect for him. If you're if it's lagging for you guys, you gotta have to refresh, because I haven't dropped a single frame since it's uh, reconnected. Guess this means I'm gonna have to edit things now. Aw, oh, darn it. No, I didn't start the stream, Tojo. The stream died and it just reconnected a moment ago. So it just sent out all the notifications again. You see. Alright, looks like we're about to win. Let's actually see their animations, though, if they have any. No, they don't have any. That's the grand reveal, everybody. They don't have any. <laughs> he popped me a little bit, but that's okay. Ectoplasma. We basically win. Come on, this is boring. You make silly moves, Aster. Go ahead, make your funny little move before I turn off your animations again. From my hand, I activate a spell. Now he's gonna Miracle Ocean and that guy to make a second Terra Firma. Come, I fusion summon a monster. Welcome to the slow, slow play. Battle time. Go, my monster attacks. Pop. Go! I launch a direct attack. Pop. Let me give you advice from a pro. You lose control of yourself, you lose the duel. And let me... Yeah, he's an expert at that. Don't worry. He is a big expert at letting that happen. I'm worried the whole stream is just gonna crash again after that. Man, you're strong. I feel better now that I can leave this chump. Ah, oh, too strong. Really wanted the win. Asprey, be my tag partner. Hm, I think I'll have a hard time finding a partner as bad as you. Asprey, why not be my partner next? Because I don't want to be near this guy any longer. I'm going home. See ya. Thanks again. I'll see you around. I don't know why these guys are suddenly here. That's so strange. There's another event? Bro, there's back-to-back -back events all of a sudden with these. I can't open the menu here, so I can't turn off animations yet. Let's see what this is. Yeah, apparently a bunch of people are getting the ping right now because the st for those that missed it, the stream just randomly died and Twitch would not let me reconnect. Um, oh, he made it with the dino girl. Good for him. <laughs> oh boy. You see here, sorry to ask all of a sudden, but would you duel me? Today I found a duelist that uses a dino deck like me to be a tag partner. Yeah, me. Having the same deck ought to make a tag team super powerful. Yes, very powerful. So, you ready? Let's stop stalling and get this duel on. D duel on. Good for him. He patched things up with her. He's not calling her a fake dino fan anymore. Dino pair. I'm destined to win this duel. Anything you do will end in defeat. Here we go. This is why we turn these off. They're so long and repetitive. 
Me and my dinos are evolving and nothing can stop us. You can't keep a dino down. My turn. Draw! From my hand, I activate a field spell. Yeah. Aster has no right to look so smug. Fort for duty, I special summon a monster. Front and center, I summon a monster in attack position. He's doing it again. I set a card. That'll do for now. I'll show you how pros duel. My turn. Draw. From my hand, I activate a spell. Go on, discard your destiny hero. From my hand, I activate a spell. Yeah, I mentioned the manga earlier. I was playing, um... I read, like, the first nine nine or ten chapters of it so far. It's neat. Feels like anything barely gets a chance to get going, though. Nothing's real. Not a whole lot has really happened in it. All right, he's going for the attack. Ah! Oh! That tickles. Do it again. Ah! Oh! Haha, <laughs> that tickles. I sent a monster. I sent a card. I flip over a card. We've lost so many minutes. Here I come. My turn. I draw. Let her, let her make her move. Why not? From my hand, I activate a spell. Nothing plot relevant has happened. The most exciting thing that happened was, um... The uh, most exciting thing that's happened today so far is just, uh, the stream dying. <laughs> I'm a little worried right now. It looks like the bitrate is kind of, like, going up and down, but not enough to cause any issues to the stream. If Twitch dies again, I might have to call this an early day. I don't know if I can finish Paper Lily if, it's, if it, like, disconnects multiple times again, but for now, let's just see how it goes. Oh, look, chat, it's finally my turn. It's been like five minutes. <laughs> yeah. Standby phase, woodsman. Hell yes. All right. Let's turn these off now. Holy moly. Good, they're still off. Okay, now we're probably going to heavy storm here. Oop, you. MST and that. Not bad, not bad. Hmm. Who can I emergency call when this monster battles a monster? Now, this thing's going to pop something back to the hand anyway. That sucks. So it's best to crash Stratos into it, I feel. So let's do that. Oh, Stratos. There you are. Let's put this down. Hmm. Add a card to my hand. Okay. Here's what we're gonna do now. I'll activate this thing's effect to get Skyscraper. Not that. can't change its attack position, but it's okay. Alright, now we're gonna go to the battle phase. Now we're getting smacked back. And I guess with that, we'll end our turn. Yeah, yeah, throw it Necroshade. That'll show him. That'll show him how it's done. We'd be at, like, turn four still if I didn't turn those animations back off. <laughs> they're cool at first, but, like, they're so long. 
Because they gotta do one for every little thing, even like drawing a card. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Put Stratos on board. Hmm. Would that be enough? Gilosaurus came out like that. I could probably just make use of Skyscraper instead to beat over this thing. So I could probably just throw down Ocean instead, since I can't fuse anything. Nope, don't do that. It's Skyscraper time. As we all know, the, si the Skyscraper buffs the power of the dude in the ocean. That makes sense. Nice. Come on, Aster, you can do it. You can't blow it. Yeah, take a wild heart. Miracle fusion something. What are you doing? Oh, he's making terra firma. We've been seeing this card a lot more lately. When I played with Jaden, we never used it. But we always have Ocean and Woodsman on hand, and I don't even run multiple copies of them. Welcome back, Minard. How you doing? We're having a wholesome day. Which may or may not end abruptly due to Twitch for some reason. Okay, I can use Stratos to pop that back row. No. Yeah, let's do this. Or not. Hmm. Doesn't matter. What Twitch doing? It randomly killed the stream. It wasn't my internet. It wasn't my internet, because I could still... Chat was still going just perfectly fine. It was only the Twitch connection. Um, I could make Necro Shade, but I don't need to do that. We should be okay to finish with this now. Aha! Gotcha. Last time Twitch, like, died like that was when there was, like, a Fortnite event or something. And it broke everyone else's stream. 1683. Let's enjoy the events now. Hey, Asprey, you sure are a strong duelist. Strong. Guess we'll go and find ourselves our next opponent. L look! Hey, Asprey, let's duel again sometime. Um, thank you. Really like if we could duel again. She's so polite. She's so polite. Hang on. How long was I even going? The timer's all messed up because of the stream dying. Looks like I, I was playing for an hour and a half before this. Well, I got a bunch of duel points for that event. That's neat. So now, I say we go for the gold sandwich and finish off Aster's events already. Oh, he got a new partner already. He don't like her. He got sick of her. Yu-Gi-Oh! sells weebs on the unrealistic dream of a girlfriend that's obsessed with dinosaurs but is shy and quiet. Those people aren't real. Nonsense. I guess it's not bad. <laughs> She's shy and quiet, but she wants to tell you all about the Stegosaurus's spine. Come on. Yeah, I got it. Uh, the Big March of Animals. Mask of Darkness. Zaborg. There we go. We need that gold sandwich. Come on, Aster. I haven't seen it on the roulette once, though. And I still haven't seen it. Oh, boy. He didn't handle the divorce well. They took all his dinos. Oh, how could they? Even the cool red T-Rex toys. I've gotten multiple cards today, but no gold sandwich. Oh, damn it. He didn't like that. Come on. Oh. Welcome, everybody. I see a lot of people didn't get the initial ping, and going live again seemed to uh, give people <laughs> the alert that I'm live. Yeah, let them have that. I'm gonna play Yu-Gi-Oh for, for like a while longer and see if I can finish Paper Lily still. That's such a good horror game, but um... It's a lot longer than I thought. 
it's pretty much impossible to get all the endings in the first go. Damn, no gold? Seriously? No gold at all. Uh. You know what we should do? We should just go to bed and do the tournament tomorrow first. That'll give us more points. Here, let's go do it. Jaden already pulled all the gold. Alright, what am I doing? I'm just walking in and out to reset the thing again. Let's do it. Everyone get ready for comfy time. Comfy Yu-Gi-Oh hour. Oh, hey, the cat's here. You go in the dual tournaments. Well, I guess we can't talk to the cat, even though it's spawned literally right next to us today. We're going for the championship. Ah, oh, despawns. Okay. New goal, Aster. Do not blow it this time. Do not. No, the parody Jaden and Kaiba did not even have animations. They had nothing. First to go. No, Aster. You won't blow it this time, right? You may actually have edits now. You can do this. Which means I might be the one who blows it now. Okay, no problem. You can do it. You can do it. Yes, you can. Summon that Stratos. What are you doing? Wait, Shaman? I thought for sure he'd search out Wild Edge. Or Blade Edge first to make Wild Edge. Alright then. Interesting play. She can't be destroyed by battle, but he's certainly given the smackdown to her. No problem. Hysteric fairy. Oh, she's powerful. Uh-oh. That's a big field. Yay. Hmm can pop two of those. Probably should also go for the field spell. First, I'm gonna do this, though. Okay, they're popped. Now I'm gonna go ahead and put you down. Do I want to pop as many as possible? I feel like it's best if I search. Get you. And we're gonna go ahead and pop two cards. I'm gonna have to get rid of the field spell because it makes it too easy for her to beat over our stuff. And I'll say this one. It was MST. Okay then. And now we play, hope the battle traps don't go off. Yep. At least that happened with a weaker monster. Come on. Okay, there we go. I want to say he can do it. It's only solemn wishes. We gotta stop her before she outheals. Okay, good. Get Blade Edge on board. Pierce? Doesn't she stop the battle phase? No, she doesn't. That's the other one. I think we got her. Never mind. Stratos has no defense, man. Why would you put him in defense mode? That's a lot of cards back there, buddy. Oh, we can win with Ceasefire. Hmm. Put you up again. You'll be a backup plan in case we get hit by something silly. Alright, we should win with this. Aha! Even Marshmallow can't save you, girl. Okay, 577. First duel of the tournament is won. Get out of here, child. You lose, because you're a loser. You, get, you see that? You lost to pros, because you're a loser. <laughs> Welcome to the real world, kid. Um, 
Hmm. Not sure who to gauge who would be the easiest in this situation. Oh, man, they're all going to be trouble for my decks, to be honest. Let's just go for it. If I win, I win. If I lose, I'll blame Aster, even if I lose. <laughs> Pretty sure these partners are preset now. Well, uh, it depends on who I picked for a partner, of course. Wow, I almost never get start with my ease anymore. He's going poly. Oh, he's immediately making terra firma. He's not gonna go for destiny draw because he can't. What am I saying? Crystal beast tortoise. Not bad. And he set the crush card. Ooh. Ring of Destruction. That sucks, but we both take the damage. All right, then. I can use my two E's to seek out that. And mm, actually, actually, I got an idea. I got an idea. First, I'm going to bait the bottomless. Okay, it's not there. Good. Okay. Okay. We're gonna do this. We're gonna make Shining Flare. Chat, I'm putting it all on this goober. Now we're gonna Righteous Justice, those two back there. Okay, yeah, that's whatever. Aster pretty much has that for the memes. What did I get rid of? Call the Haunted. Okay, that's good. And I guess I'll thin my deck with E. Make sure I have Stratos next turn. Don't need Skyscraper. Hmm. Let's see. Would it be better to attack with you... What if this thing... Did, it could be another... No. Hmm. Either way, I can't win this turn anyway. I'm gonna go for it. Be a high attack monster, please. Oh, nice! That's not much of a difference either, either then. Anyway, whatever. Okay. We got him. We got him. Chat, I need to chug some water. I should do that. Chugging nice cold water. Remember to stay hydrated, little moments, or else. That's right, this is a threat. You will take care of yourself. I'll put the PNG tuber on the screen if you don't take care of yourself. I'll scare you away with anime. That's why Twitch really disconnected. It disconnected via tw uh, cringe. He miracled another flare. Damn, we slaughtering. Yeah. Now he did a pretty good job that time. Not gonna lie. Jim is such a pain in the ass to fight because of his face down strategy. Hmm. We don't keep up the monster. Jaden can also slaughter us if he gets the good opening hand to counter our heroes. You know what? I'm just gonna, I'm gonna bite the bullet and do it because I don't want to fight the teacher. Jaden can easily brick though. Heroes can really do that. Like they can just throw their whole hand into one play, and then the monster they they built just gets popped, and then bam. There's nothing you can do except hope you draw like something. Come back from that. I don't think Adrian's that bad. I almost never duel him, though. Okay. He's got a decent hand, I think. He's adding Clayman. Setting those. Here comes Jim. Jim's setting his monsters. 
Now then. Hmm. If I were to search my poly. Hmm. Hang on, I could just make Thunder Giant right now and pop into him. I'm worried about his back row cards, but hey. Hmm. Actually, you know what I could do? Would it be better to make Necroid Shaman? Because he's going to have a flip effect monster, so it's not going to have a lot of attack points anyway. Forcing him to put it in attack mode. Does Necroid Shaman do that? No, it might just be better to run Thunder Giant because I can beat over what he puts down anyway. I'm going to do it. I'll just make Thunder Giant. I could make Mudball Man! Chat, we're not making Mudball Man against the Flip Effect guy. <laughs> he doesn't even need to beat over it. Okay. And I can normal summon you for the hell of it. Now I'm sure it's going to have a lot of defense, so let's attack it. Oh, it was Goggle Golem. Of course it was. Of course it was. Damn, I should have attacked with Ocean. Too little too late. At least he doesn't seem to have any battle traps. That's the big one I'm worried about. Whenever I make a fusion hero, I'm always terrified that um it's gonna do that. Oh, great. Hang on. This is fine, actually. Go ahead, bring it back, buddy. Go ahead, bring it back. I don't care. Not yet. Oh, I could just bring back Ocean right now. And then go for another attack. Yeah, I think I'll do it. Then Ocean can use its effect on Aster's turn. Bringing back Swamp's too risky, I feel. Even with Ring there, I don't think so. Just go for the damage with Swamp and let him bring back, um... Let him bring back Clayman on his turn. Maybe he can do something with that. Can't finish him this turn, but it would have been impressive if we could. Alright, we'll end turn here. Oh, boy. Oh, no! Anything but that! Let it buff first. Yeah, buff it. Ring of Destruction, baby! All the utility, all the draw games. I... This game has really explained to me why this card needed to be super banned. What, he brought Stratos back and then he didn't play it. Good job, genius. He wanted the style of Persinatrix. <laughs> oh boy. This is the only Yu-Gi-Oh game that will have this card playable, so I'm, I'm enjoying it while I can. <laughs> Destiny Bears, do it again, chat. All right, let's fight Jaden. Who else is left? Is Jaden the teacher? Is there another group here? Nope. I'd rather fight these two. The teachers just always have the most best decks. For sure. They always kick my ass. And I'm a streamer. I need to look like I know what I'm doing, so I have to bully the Slifers every, uh, every episode. Neospatians. Oh, we absolutely won this. He had Neo Spatians, not heroes. Oh, nice. Yeah, that's right. Discard it. Discard it, bro. Come on. Come on. Come on. Turn one Wild Edge. Wait, what? You're not going to use the Blade Edge? Okay. Just save that Swamp for something. But what do I know? He's going. Okay, not bad. Bait your MST with this. Yeah, I thought so. There's only one card you got left back there. We want to make sure it doesn't cause any problems, so I'll use it now when I have one. It was Call the Haunted. Good call. That's Clayman. Now I'm going to summon Stratos who is going to allow me to add a designated card to my hand. Hmm. In this situation... Do this. 
Make sure I get my Skyscraper out after all. We don't need it this turn. I should save it in case he MSTs. Hmm. It's Jaden that's in it. Jaden doesn't run recruiters, right? Neos alias. Well, so sorry, my dude. You're getting popped. Yeah, that looks fine. Ooh, he got nothing. Now we're gonna flip Ceasefire. Burn him for a little damage there. Nice. This one has zero of all this. Okay. I think we won. Oh, there goes Wild Edge. There goes you. Okay. No, we didn't win, win it, finish it this turn. Aster gonna put Clayman in attack mode. He needs to just... Yeah. He's playing Pathfinder. We're taking a thousand off that. Okay, we can easily beat it. For mo in more ways than one. Hold up. What does this thing do again? As long as monsters remain on your side of the field, battle damage to you becomes zero. Okay then, if that's the case... Do this. Hold up, double check to make sure it's not immune. And now we're gonna bring the heat. I don't see why he Destiny drawed that, in case he really needs his Neo space. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jaden, you little goober. It looks like we've gone a half hour and there hasn't been another issue. I can only assume that Twitch is fine now. It was just a random hiccup at the wrong time for me. Nice. Ugh. So it looks like I have to beat everyone. There's not, like, an extra team this time. At least he's generally pretty easy, so... Hmm. I l oh, wait, this is the easy guy. It's Wade. Oh, man. Okay, I think we could do this. I, I shouldn't eat my words. Glad you're all having a good time, chat. I appreciate getting the stream all the time. It's good. Hmm. I'm glad that lately people like a lot of the new changes, too. Like, doing more short stream days has been very helpful for me getting more stuff done. As well as the PNG tuber. Excellent. King of the Swamp. Perfect. Nice. Okay. Okay, this is good. I have really enjoyed doing that a lot. People were very supportive with it. I was nervous with it. <laughs> but since I started talking about uh, trying it last month, I kind of just told myself, yeah, I'm going to I'm going to do it. And I just like I spent a bunch of time looking for an artist and got it all set up. Oh, wow. He turned one freaking dogma. Bro. He's not screwing around today. Holy crap. Whoa. This is what he thinks happened. Oh, uh, yeah, never mind. We're dead. <laughs> now we're dead. <laughs> never mind. Never mind. Hmm. Snatch Steel. This is why Snatch Steel is banned, everybody. Alrighty then. What do we have in here? I can Miracle. Hang on. If I discard you for that. Hmm. What? It's not going to be enough to beat over Dogma. Wait, no. I could search out Stratos and then use that to... Yes, yes, I could. Hang on, hang on. First, I'll get you in the graveyard by doing this. Hang on, hang on. But before I continue my conversation chat, I need to focus for this. Get Stratos out. Okay, so currently in my hands. First, we'll bait the negates by making Terra Firma. I have a plan. I have a plan. Just watch. Just watch. Yeah. 
Yeah, I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. That was all part of the bait, chat. That was all the bait. Don't worry. No, no. We don't have enough resources for Wild Wingman. We're just gonna make Wild Edge from the grave. We're gonna put you down. Okay. Now we're gonna play Stratos and not search. There, there, see? Big Brain Teddy did it all right. Now the giant rat's there. Now we hope we don't get mirror forced. Didn't seem like I was allowed to use Dogma's effect though. He tried to read me, but I was prepared for it. The whole point of Terra Firma was to bait that trap from coming out. We did it. We won the tournament. Now, what the hell was I talking about? My crusty anime character in the corner. That's right. More Mario Party stuff is coming up. Um, I mentioned it earlier, but the Switch Online has the first three Mario Parties, and I can get the GameCube ones going. Hang on, I'll fix my posture. The GameCube ones will be pretty fun as well, because it's been a long while since I got to play those. I just kind of play them on, like, my brother's birthday every once in a while. Oh, looky here. The last team standing is Asprey and Aster. Talk about a great pair. As your prize, I'll give you this. Nice. That concludes today's tournament. Not a bad result. Okay, he gets a bit of hearts. Now it's Monday. Hey, it's morning. You ready? Let's go. Well, time to get more sandwiches. I should down some water. What a way for it to end like that, huh? Hang on. I'm thirsty. Mm. Chat, do y'all have a favorite Mario Party that you're looking forward to seeing the CPUs play on? I've been kind of excited to see some in 2 and 4. Okay... I'm not even sure what my favorite, like, what my most played one is. I never really played Mario Party 3 as much as 2 and 1. Like, I owned the first three on N64 as a kid. But, um, I don't know, I just, like... I remember being salty that it didn't have, like, the costumes and stuff that, like, 2 did. Okay. Yeah, I mentioned doing that earlier. I was going to put a little accessory on the VTuber to match the board, but I kind of need someone to draw that first. I don't know if I'll have it prepared for Pirate Land later this week. Oh yeah, I'm going to try Battle Mode with CPUs as well. We'll do a special. My favorite GameCube ones are probably 4 and 7. And 6 is a close second. 5 is good, but I never, like, played that one as much, because that's the one that had, like, the crusty bits with the orb section. 8's also good, I just never played it as much because it was the motion control one, right? Alright, let's do that. Draw a crusty MS Paint in my, uh, eye patch. <laughs> I should just draw a really bad pirate hat and put that on my character. Why not? You can layer it on top. I am going to play the Switch ones as well. Oh, I see gold finally. Damn. I was doing good, doing good with the card pulls lately. Looks like I might have to get it there by doing like this. My mo One of my most played maps that my family and I would play all the time, like, um, me, my brothers, and my mom, we would play Neon Heights and Mario Party 7 all the time. Okay. Cheese sandwich. One of the boards I really want to see the, uh, the computers play is, you know, those ones where you, like, kind of, like, build up a hotel in order to, like, uh, like, kind of like Monopoly, where you just kind of, like, build a hotel and kind of force your opponents to give up their coins and stars as they walk by. My family would never want to play those ones, but I, I thought they were cool. So I want to see how the computers play them on like a long 50 turn game. 
You see, kind of like Fortune Street, but there's just some Mario parties would have an entire board that's like that. Let me see. Can you do Fortune Street with um CPUs only? That might be interesting to watch as well. It's a little spin-off thing. Okay, we're not getting gold here. Come on, come on. Oh, I see gold. Damn, man. Messed up the gold sandwich twice, I'm afraid. Whatever, I got the money from the tournament. May as well just max out his heart like this. I'm I'm so done playing with you, Aster. Just be finished already, would you? Top grade salad. Come on, we're almost there. Take your money and get away from me. Cyrus is going to be such a downer when we play with him. You know he is. Come on. Nope. Let's keep going. Dude. I've only seen two gold sandwiches and I botched them twice. The gold doesn't even matter. I just need to fill it out. Oh, I see it. <laughs> of course I get it now. Uh, yeah. All right, chat. Last event with Aster, and we can move on to Cyrus. Let's make a save. Okay. Today's testing. Oh, no, I have to do a test first? We'll have fun, fun, fun test today. Uh, all right, chat. I have to school before I do this. Let's start off with the written exam. Want to hear the explanation about the written exam? Sure again. How much you know about cards? All right, this. Match the illustration that appears the left one. If you think the top one's the correct, press that. If you think the bottom one's correct, press X. Try to answer as many as you can within the time limit. Exam begins now. All right, decipher that card. Taylor the Fickle. Muse A, Bean Scorpion, Monster Gate, Tiger, Royal Keeper, Neos Force, Mugroth, Moron, Water, Big Evolution Pill, That Thing, That Thing, Canyon, Insect Barrier, uh, That Thing, okay, Dark, Bible Guardian, Earth, That Thing, Trap Master, Ritual, Normal, Normal, Rising Air Current, Effect Monster, Rising Energy, Fire, oops, got it wrong, Magical Explosion, Mystical Beast, Mirror Wall, Poison Draw Frog, Fire Darts, Dark City, Yadagarasu, that, whatever that is, Decoy Roid, Ghoul, Bat, Legendary Fisherman, Future Fusion, Dark, uh, DD Crow, Play Charge, Spellcaster, Mass Sorcerer, Insect, Continuous, no, Ambulance, Guardian Angel, D Counter, UFO Roid, Light, uh, That Thing, Woodland Sprite, Earth, Eldeen, That Thing, Dark, uh, Level Down, Light, That Thing, Warrior, Beast, Light Force Sword, Anti Regeki, Rock, Counter, Insect, Firewall, Trap Card, Yozanru, Effect. Oops, I hit the wrong one. That thing. Damn it. What'd I get? I got a 995, everybody. Problem level one. Come on now. I got three wrong. Score was that high score bonus. Oh come on, you can give me more that more for that. Ugh. 
Did I almost max the score or does it go over a thousand? The written exam is over. Next is the practical exam. If you're ready, go to the dual field. Your opponent's already waiting. Hi, everybody. How you doing? Oh, I gotta fight these chumps. When you're ready, talk to the opponents. Are both teams ready? Let's go. I feel like I got more questions done in the first time I did that. Lose, win. I feel like I only reached the test again because I've been stuck with Aster for so astronomically long. The only time I played for so long was when I had my first partner, and that was because I didn't have, like, cards to really do as much, you know what I mean? Hope you're all feeling well. Welcome, Captain. How you doing? All right. Discard your friend. Summon more friends. Ooh. He's gonna do fancy stuff. No, he's not. He's gonna set Woodsman. That's right. Attack it. Ooh, they attack the face down. And now we get a free poly on my turn. Thank you, Aster. Unfortunately, I don't really need it. Hmm. You know, what should we go for? We need to take out you. The bear, that is. Sorry, chap, but teddies need to go. I don't take any pleasure in this. I just want you all to realize that. Maybe it might be best to attack the face down instead, though, to be honest, since it's gonna recruit something else. Never mind. No battle damage for you, then. Oh, it's, of course, the turtle. Damn. Well, you know what I should do, actually? Hang on. I'm gonna set this. Just in case. Then again, Woodsman will probably give him a plus anyway, so maybe I should have set a Miracle instead. Yeah. This is a problem. Okay, thin the deck a little bit. Go ahead and seek out what you need. Yes, he's gonna make Shining Flare? He's gonna make Shining Flare. No, no he's gonna make Wild Edge, okay. Hello, friend, welcome to the stream. How you doing? Everyone is legally required to be comfy. Okay, he's not activating the effect. Take them all out. Take them all out. Punish the teddies. I like to imagine everyone is watching at home with a teddy or a plush in their arms. But some of you probably can't afford one, in which case, you're a fake fan and should come back when you can afford one. <laughs> I'm kidding. A teddy or a cat? A doggy something. A little fuzzy friend to hold. Or a plushy friend. Okay, that's a lot of cards he's got back there. Hmm. Looks like I can Miracle from the grave as well, but first let's bait uh, Bottomless or something. Hang on a second, I'm gonna see what I have. King of the Swamp. I'm gonna make Shining Flare. I'm gonna, that's what I'm gonna do. And then I'm gonna pop his whole back row with Righteous Justice. This card is so goofy. I love it. A redeem for hugging a, pu a plushie, pet, or friend. That's right. I've got tons of plushies. I have no room for them, though. When I can, I want, like, the li a living room set up with a couch full of them while I game. Oh. Oh, no. Not that. Please. One. Two. Two. Three, four. Chat, you want to see a murder happen? Because you're about to. Let's get him. Of course it's one with zero. Of course. So much for that. Everyone gets a uh, cloud on it now. Why did Wild Edge get that? I'm sorry. Hang on. Oh, what, what did that say? Uh, blah, 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 blah. To the level of the monster that destroyed it. Oh, a lot the same level. I see, I see. Lady Heat needs to get a hit in, too, because she doesn't get to do a whole lot. We win. Turn eight. Let's 
677. Look at that. That was nice. Stop. You finished all the exams. Your exam result is the average result for your written and practical. My results are... You got a 1,495. That's okay, I suppose. God dang it. Chat, when will I be good enough for Duel Academy? When do I have to give 1,500%? Try harder next time. Heh. Not a bad result, right? Of course, he got a big boost to affection after we already maxed it out. You got a great score, so we'll give you a reward. Um... Just give me DP, I guess. Make up for the crap I spent on Aster. The random card pool is garbage from what I understand, so... Alright, so now we're basically just gonna go to bed. Let me see. Let's make a save. We're about to do the finale of Aster's story now. Let's just hit end the day. Oh, well, it's still early, but I'll turn in two. See you tomorrow. Tuesday. Asprey, I still have no clue where Sartorius is, but it looks like he's been taken over by the Light of Destruction again. I promised Sartorius I would save him. Sartorius, where are you? Aster, Asprey, I know where Sartorius is. Jaden, are you for real? Wait up, Jaden. How did you find out all of a sudden? Yeah, all you did is look a card. What? All you did is look a card? Princeton's three Ojama brothers will lead us to Sart Sartorius. Three brothers? What the heck are you talking about? Anyway, come with me. Aster, Asprey, come on. Fine with me. Wait for me, Jaden. All this running is killing me. Oh, I have to actually go now. Where are we going? To the event. The main gate. Oh, is this where we need the look? Hee hee hee. Can I help you with something? I already knew you'd come. Your fate. You. Wait. I already knew you'd come. You was your fate to come. You was your fate to come. Did they, I think they mean it. It was your fate to come. Sartorius? What are you doing? How could you bring back the Light of Destruction? I didn't bring it back. It never left space at all. And it has told me again to rebuild this filthy world. Give me a break. This isn't the Sartorius I know. You're being controlled by the Light of Destruction again. As I said, you cannot change fate. Why did you steal Destiny Hero Plasma? Destiny Hero Plasma? I have never heard of... Uh, Ugh, Aster. I'm sorry. Artorius? Is that the real you? I took it to protect you, Aster. Sorry. The light. It's too strong. Sartorius, don't you worry. I haven't forgotten my promise. And I'd save you from the light of destruction a thousand times if need be. Ugh. Ugh. I can't allow it. Sartorius? Ah! Sartorius. Ha 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 ha. First I will destroy you. Then I will rebuild this world. Mu ha 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 ha. I'm gonna need your help to save Sartorius and the world. A tag duel? Very well then. I also have a strong partner here to join me. Huh? Isn't that? Sartorius? How could you use your own sister? The light, it's so strong, it's controlling her to do its will, too. Come on, Asprey. This duel is a duel we can't afford to lose. This time, I'll save you for good. Well, that escalated quite a bit. Alright. Let's try again. Sartorius and Sartorius, because they forgot to change your name. Mirror Festival, see the light. Let's see how funky this is. Is anything going to top the, the Chaz brothers, though? They were easily the best. Oh. He's making Inferno? Well, then. 
We're seeing all the weird heroes come out today. Cup of Ace. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh, what are you doing? Hey, thanks. Well, this is gonna be obnoxious as hell. It's doing that. What is th what is that? The Empress? Is she wearing a bra, or are those just, like, blueberries? What is its effect? When summon, toss a coin. This card gains the effect. Heads, once per turn, you can normal summoner set Arcana Force once from your hand. <gasps> Cannot be activated the turn. This is summon. Each summon monster is normal summoner set on your opponent's side of the field. Summon card from your hand to the graveyard. Um, which one activated? I'm sorry? Doesn't seem like there's a little counter that shows that. Heads activated? Okay. Alright, if that's the case... Should be able to beat over you without the battle traps. Let's do this first. I don't need to use Righteous Justice yet, especially with Wildheart having immunity. So I'll just do this for now. Nice. Oops, all heads. Foolish Burial. You're milling. You're calling. You're playing the Dark Creator. That looks like an anime card. Is that a real thing? I've never seen that one before. This one might be big trial and error until I win. If they just win the coin flips, it's just going to be like hell. Oh. Well, there goes that thing. Yes. Miracle Baby, let's go. Make that wild edge. It's a real card now, but it's completely different from the anime effect. Okay. There comes Blueberry Girl. Okay, it's heads, I guess. It would be upside down if it was tails, right? It's trying to be fancy with its arcana shenanigans. Okay. Hmm. Let's see... Necroshade and Sparkmand. Hmm. I can make this. Hmm. Then it gets sent to defense mode after that, which annoys me. <sighs> I feel like I should just wait and keep Swamp for later. I could just put down Captain Gold for the hell of it, because I got Skyscraper up. We don't need to worry about popping the back row. For now, let's just, like, stay alive. Because everything, no matter what I do, the whole board could just get wiped from a bad uh, coin flip. That's what I'm basically seeing right now. You know what? I'll I'll set this in case Aster can use it. Arcanas are bad because they're all luck dependent. Oh my god. Arcanas are bad because they're luck dependent, right? Anything that depends on luck is just not good for Yu-Gi-Oh. What? Oh. I didn't realize she even set two cards. Oh, he got nothing. He's not even gonna premature burial something. I'm surprised he didn't try to premature burial freaking uh, Captain Gold again. Yeah, you know what? Why not? Give me my, give me my good card. Oh, I didn't need that, but I'll take it. Hmm. I could make Dark Bright now, but it would just be wide open if I attacked with it. Honestly, better off not doing that and waiting. Wait until I can discard Necroshade with, uh, Lightning Vortex. So let's just do this. Spear Creighton, okay. Hmm. If that's the case... It's already in the graveyard, so you know what? Hang on. No, this gets... The Spear Creighton puts him face down. Oh, wait a second. Would this be worth it? No, I'm probably better off picking Heat, to be honest. Oh, you picked that! Damn it. Wow, that's unfortunate. If that's the case, hang on. Destroyed by battle. If this card cannot attack a player directly. If this card destroys a monster, inflicts 700 damage to your opponent. Okay. 
No problem, I can still do this. I can still do this. I can still do this. There we go. See? An Ojama yellow pop figure? I don't think... Listen. I have a lot of anime figurines in my room. But... I'd have a more enjoyable time explaining those to friends and family than I would displaying an Ojama yellow figurine in my room. <laughs> All right, he's making Shining Flare Wingman. Let's hope we win with this. He's... Oh! He gave up the Necro Shade to play the Necro Shade. Genius. Nice. Uh, wow, we just won. I didn't see that coming, not gonna lie. <laughs> I think they just bricked after that, those first couple hands. Nice. Arg. You did it! You showed him. Sweet, Aster and Asprey, you guys rock. We did it. Sartorius? Brother? Ah, Sartorius. This time, even I gave into the light. You're back, Sartorius. Aster, I'm so sorry. Acquire Destiny Hero Plasma. The light, it. Don't worry about it, I saved you again. And I'll save you once more if there's ever a next time. Aster. What the? Where am I? Jaden, what is everyone doing here? This horrible white uniform. I thought I took it off. Everyone's back to normal. You're awesome, Aster. Oh, well, that just about does it for the Light of Destruction, huh? Jaden, you've always laid- you're always laid back, aren't you? Am I? Anyway, that was a really cool duel. Thank you, Asprey. You're the only person I could trust as my partner. You'll go pro after you graduate, right? Something tells me you'd make one heck of a rival. Yeah, pro duelist, what a great idea! If you become a pro, you can duel all day long. Jaden, I think you'll find it harder to graduate than enter the pros. Really? Yeah, Jaden, just look at how horrible your test scores are. Ah, oh, man. Now I'm a total nervous wreck. I gotta go study. Misawa, teach me how to study. Oh, Jaden, wait up! Sartorius, see you guys later. Jaden Truesdale, wait for me! I bet he gives up studying in ten minutes. Hey, Asprey, I am most grateful to you. I feel that Aster is grateful to you as well. Everyone, thank you so much. Wait a minute, wouldn't it be faster if I learned it from a pro? Hey, Aster, come on, let's study. Uh, sorry, Jaden, I have an appointment, you see, and... Hey, don't pull my arm. Jaden, let me go. Come on, Asper, you should head out too. We did it. Hey, stop laughing and help me, would you? I'm your partner, right? Let me go, Jaden. We did it. I never want to play with this man again. Oh, it probably will have to in Tag Force 3. Hopefully he's better there. We'll have, like, a whole two extra cards of support. Oh, there we go. That's the credits. Overwrite the data? Yes. Back to the start. Konami. He gets a fusion, and that's basically it, of course. Don't learn from him, Jaden. You won't like that. Okay. Will you watch the opening day event? No. Alright, we've beaten with, with, uh... Wait, what? You... Wait a second, you can change it to their Society of Light outfit? Does it stay that way for the whole game? That's weird. It doesn't... Seem to affect Chaz's clear, though. <laughs> okay, we've cleared it with a lot of people now. The only people missing are uh, Alexis, Cyrus, and Blair. Wait, what about Bastion? He's not. Is he tier two? Yes, he is. I can play with him if I want. Oh, wait. Dorothy and Sadie are unlocked? I didn't realize that. I, when did I unlock them?
Duelist 3. Yeah, that's all them. Well, we're playing with Cyrus. We know that. I should do a playthrough with Sadie, because she would be like... She would compliment my burn deck a lot, right? But hang on. Let's play with Cyrus now, because we can actually see Zane show up with this one, right? All right. Now, what do we call this, chat? Let me see. Um, mecha teddies, mecha bears, probably. Baroids. Nah, yeah, that works too. Hang on. It's all about the teddy bears. The mecha bears. There we go. Day one. Morning, Asprey. We're partners starting today. Hmm? You still sleeping? Come on, it's the first day. Hope you get it together. Anyway, let's be good partners from now on, okay? Okay, chat. First things first, we need to make a machine deck. I have a lot of cards, but let's go get his pack specifically. Wait, there's already an event? Ah, uh, this could get me a lot of duel points. I should probably check it. We can get a peek at what's in his deck anyway. Hmm. You two again? Oh god, are you gonna break the stream? It's these dudes again, seriously. I play for like, like dozens and dozens and dozens of hours and I never see these guys and then I see them back to back like this, wow. Yeah, I, I've done a playthrough with Bright. I, I play with some of the tier two characters, cause why not? Milk this series for all it's worth. Milk every Tag Force game. The Chaos. Super Kaiba. Me and my roids. Alright, let's see what this boy's got. I'm gonna use my heroes. Since they're already set. Archfiend Soldier. Fairy Meteor Crush. Well. That got you, boop, son. Well then, let's activate Captain Gold's effect. Put down the Skyscraper. 1900 on you. Which means when I, hmm. What's this do? When this face down card is destroyed, sent to the graveyard, special some of them for me, show on for, okay, that's fine. We'll put down the heat. Then, we're gonna bop into you and get destroyed and beamed by Skyscraper. Come on. He's playing Giant Orc and Cyber Dragon. Hang on. Hmm. No. May as well let him hit me with the one with 100 more attack points. Get cylindered. Okay, he's gonna go for the steamroid. He's gonna premature burial. Oh! He picked the right- Wow, he actually revived it without killing it. I'm proud of him. Cyrus is already putting Aster to shame, I have to say. He actually, like, immediately took those out. I'm shocked. Sadly, Steamroid's got that annoying effect. Okay. Hmm. What do I have in the graveyard right now? Heat. That won't do me any good, unless I could make Wild Edge. Better to just grab Stratus for the hell of it, then. Do that. Put him down. Then we'll add some cards to our hand, because that's what we do. Take you. And I guess we'll just attack into him for now. 
Let him summon his little garbage. Phantom of Chaos. Wait, what? Uh, isn't this the thing that lets you cheese out the Sacred Beast or something? No, they're fusion monster, but I think that's modern. You see... This card's name is Trina's... Any battle damage your opponent takes from battle involving this card becomes zero. Well, alright then. You take the damage then, you may as well have not even played it there. End turn. Heart of Avarice. Okay, he's putting all those back into his deck to draw some cards. Magical Mallet. He's putting all those back in his deck to draw some cards. Now, come on, win. I love how they're all making the same pose in the pictures. Oh, Dimensional Wall. Ooh, so sorry. We're still kicking. They only got a few life points left. They can't afford any mistakes right now. We basically win with Ceasefire, for crying out loud. Nice. Put you down in case you want to activate another trap card. Nimble Mamonga. Oh. Oh, he's going to stall the game out. Hang on, I, I may as well just end my turn and flip up Ceasefire. Yeah, how about that? Nimble your way out of this, you jerk. 3,000. Get beaned. Get beaned. 5.06. Yeah, yeah, same thing. We literally just saw this a moment ago. I can't go to the store now because class started, damn it. Closed. I wonder if Sadie is here. Oh, check. Cyrus, come on. Just because you perform better than Aster in one duel doesn't mean you can immediately start being a little creepy. Cyrus is turning in the chat when I highlighted Sadie on the menu. Alright, in and out one more time. And it should be the right time of day. Let's make a machine deck with roids. Hey, cat! Never seen it here before, pet said. Meow! Awesome, still no heart, though. Want some cards? Alright, did I unlock anything new? It's been a while since I looked at this. Hmm. I feel like there's a thing loose on my headphone wire here. I think I got it. Where the heck is he? Is this it? Machines Force? I have 8% of the cards here. Give me a whole box for 2,000. Give me a whole box for 2,000 more. I say three boxes should do it first. Hmm. All right, open them all up. Let's see what we got. Why is Gate Guardian in Cyrus's pack? Is it because it's a useless card right now? Hang on. I need to adjust my headphones. I need to just, like, take them out and, like, untangle my hair in them. Jeez. Infernal Dragon. This is not a machine. Rare Metal Morph. This is not a good good thing. Cyber Dark Impact. We're not using Cyber Darks. So we're not stupid. Heavy Mech Support Platform. Union? No. Wonder Garage, he's already got that. Psychroid, ew. Viacroid Connection Zone. Send to the graveyard from your side of the field or your hand fusion material monsters that are listed on a Viacroid fusion monster card and special summon that monster from, sorry, uh, your fusion deck. This special summon is treated as a fusion summon. The fusion monster special summoned by this card cannot be destroyed by effects of spells, traps, effects, monsters, and is cannot, effects cannot be negated. Is this any good? I don't know. Perfect Machine King. That's a little hefty cost to get on board. No. Cyber Esper. If this card is in face of attack position, you can look at every card your opponent draws. Alright. Damage Polarizer. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. Nope. 
Cyber Dark Horn. I don't really want to play Cyber Dark, though, to be honest. Attack Reflector Unit. Isn't this the one that's... Yeah. Tribute to Cyber Dragon, Special Summon Cyber Barrier Dragon. Isn't Cyber Barrier Dragon, like, actual ass? Like, there's no reason to play it? Like, you have to summon it by tributing Cyber Dragon with a trap card. And it has to be from the hand or deck, so you basically are playing a brick. Like, you may as well just fuse them instead, right? Machine Conversion Factory. That's a pretty basic old one. Cyber Barrier and Cyber Laser both suck. Yeah, that's what they are. UFO Roid, level 6. If when this card is destroyed as a result of battle and sent to the graveyard, special summon from your deck a machine monster with 1500 attack, then shuffle your deck. This thing is like fusion fodder though, right? I don't think it's very good. 7 completed. Um... Let me see here. I Wait, what does that say? You cannot change your choice as long as this card is up on the field. Did they really have to put that at the end of the card? That is some old funny wording. Just to be like, N no, you can't do that. <laughs> That's funny. You can't change your mind later. Stop trying to, you jerk. What does the modern text of this card say? <laughs> does Do they change it to something else? Cyber Curing, uh, Kieran. Trip it in this card. Any effect damage inflicted to you can uh, become zero. Okay. UFO Roid Fighter. There's that. I don't know about running this, though. Machine King. Hmm. Okay. They took out... They took that line out of the, um... <laughs> they took out the no takesy backsies of the modern print. That's good. Let's see. I don't think that's that great. Chthonian Emperor Dragon. Photon Generator Unit. Wait, what? Wait a second, I have to tribute two Cyber Dragons for this? Oh, this is garbage. Why would anyone do that? Going so minus for a brick that's in your deck? Oh, look, Cyber Laser Dragon. There it is. It has 2,400. It's only 300 points stronger than that. Wow. Wow, that's just... What does this even do? Cannot be special summoned except with Photon Generator Unit. Once per turn, you can destroy a monster attack or defense equal to or less than this card. All right, that's that's pretty ass. No wonder it's a common. There's Cyber Dark Dragon. Acid Rain, Destroy all yeah, I'm not going to use that. Ambulance Rescue Roid. Oh, Power Bond. I got three copies of it? Oh, chat, can we go for the funny FTKs? I think we can. I think we can. <laughs> Three power bonds. Isn't it limited? Wait, it's limited, right? Uh, no, there'd be a symbol on the screen for that, I think. No, it's not limited. I think it's limiter removal that's limited, isn't it? Machine King prototype. All right, let's get some funky fusions. Well, hang on a second. Um, on a machine... Hang on a second. Due to the wording of this card, am I allowed to use King of the Swamp with Power Bond, or only is it only with Polly and Miracle? I, I think I can use King of the Swamps with this. Uh, I don't know if Future Fusion's legal right now, or if I can even get it. System down. Yeah, Cyber Ogre too. Oh, this crusty thing. Fusion Guard, Super Viacroid Jumbo Drill, uh, Steamroid, Drillroid, Submarine Roid. Okay. I could run this as well. It'd be funny. During a battle between this and a okay, it's a piercer. Three monsters for a three three K monster though. Hmm, I could yeah. Ambulance Roid. When a Roid monster is added from your grave into your hand, you can special summon this monster. Oh! Well, that answers that question. We have a future fusion now, chat. And it's at one. Ooh. The problem is, isn't, like, Cyber Dragon limited to two in this game? Because this was right after they realized how good that damn card was and how, like, meta-defining it was. So they had to, like, start putting a a damper on it, but you can still use Proto Cyber Dragon to get Cyber End, right? Oh, wait, no. Can I use two Cyber Dragons and a Swamp King to do that? Possibly. Cyber Dragon is at three here. Okay, I thought... 
I could have sworn it said two at some point, but maybe I should get a copy of the damn card first. There's Rescue Roid, Decoy Roid, Patroid, Drill... Okay, Drilloid's a decent one, but I only have one copy of it, and those all those boxes? Damn. Jetroid, Steam, Gyroid. These are such terrible freaking cards, man. Cyber Barrier Dragon. Ew. It has less... It has 800 attack. <sighs> wow. Oh, there's Cyber End. Cyber End is now a silver. Cool. It's, it's, um, it's Cyber Stein that's banned now, right? Cyber Stein you can't use in this game like you could before. Cyber Dark Edge. Oh, Gyroid's okay. Oh, there's Cyber Twin. Our boys. The twins. Exploder Dragon. Cyber Stein is banned and never coming back. Rip the Dream. Rip the Stein. The Chimera Tech Over Dragon. This one's new to me. Cyber Dragon plus one or more machine monster. This monster cannot be special summoned except by a fusion summon. When this card is fusion summoned, send all other cards you control to the graveyard. The original attack and defense of this card are 800 times the fusion material monster used for its fusion summon. Each turn, this card can attack as many of your opponent's monsters as the number of fusion material monsters used for its fusion summon. That's a mouthful right there. So... It's basically a giant beat stick with no protection, and you summon it, and you hope your opponent doesn't have Mirror Force or Bottomless. Yeah, I can get behind that. That's pretty funny if I can get it going. If I use it with Power Bond, it, it should double the original attack, and its original attack is whatever it... Yeah, it says original specifically, so it should be work fine. It's no key OTK monster. I love playing Cyber Dragon OTK in Duel Academy, so I gotta make some variation of it here. Cyber Summon Blaster. Each time a machine type monster is special summon, three damage. That's a pretty crusty burn strategy, I gotta I gotta say. I'm better off just playing Teddy Toll. Oh, there's Proto. Only one? Damn. I got like one future fusion and three power bonds though, so that's good. Oh, alright, we looped around. I need Cyber Dragon. That's probably in the deck. I got 90% of them, huh? I'm assuming I can get Cyber Dragon here if I can get the fusions, but it's probably an Ultra. Uh, we got Gate Guardian. Again. Acid Rain. Looking for a new... Oh, there it is. I got one. We need this sucker at three. So we're opening boxes till we get it. Supercharge. Another Cyber End. We have three of those now. Three Twins would be good. Oh, more Over Dragon. I've got more than three of those now. Steamroid. Yeah, that's okay to put in at the start. Overload Fusion. What's this? Remove from play from your side of the field or graveyard. Fusion monsters listed on a dark... Oh, it's for dark Cyber Darks. Okay. Okay. Maybe I'll play Cyber Darks with Zane or something. Okay. I need three of those boys. The deck is useless without three of them. Give me two more. You know what? I'm just gonna say give me three boxes. Why not? I'm still missing Chimera Tech, right? Fortress Dragon, I think it's called. Trojan Blast. Uh, Steam Gyroid. Cyber Laser. Cyber Laser is the definition of pack filler. What is even the point? Submarine Roid. There's our defender. More. I have 15 copies of Gate Guardian, and they will never be played. Ever. Well, I have eight more I'm back up to. Let me see. UFO Roid Fighter. Oh, we're not gonna run. Oh, there's one. Okay, I need one more. What else did we get here? I got three copies of Future Fusion, but I only needed the one. Oh, Limiter Removal. I pulled two at once. Well, that that's good. Nice. Oh, oh, no, that's one I already have. Never mind. Oh, I got another Proto. Nice. I have three copies of it now. This is good. I'm liking this so far. I'm going to have some fun with this. I need one more Cyber Dragon and we can build the deck. We're probably going to build the deck and just um mess around with it for the rest of the stream here. Power Bond again. Nope, didn't get it. Do that. One more copy of regular ass Cyber Dragon. Let's go. 
Cyber Twin. This is giving me all I need for everything else. Oh, there it is. Nice. Anything else? I got my third proto. Okay, now we can build the deck chat. This should be fun. This should be lots of fun. Alright, now, uh, I don't have the help Teddy prepared, but it's okay to help me with adding stuff, chat. There we go. First, let me go ahead and... Actually, you know, I could just keep the staples here in. It's probably faster to empty the deck anyway, though, to be honest. Oh, I'm going to need three cybers for sure. Let's just take out the heroes and leave the staples in. So I don't have to search for them all in the menu on the side. Let's see. Uh, do you think I should go for Luminous Spark? Because all the Cyber Dragons are light monsters, right? Okay, do I want to keep Lightning Vortex? I don't really want to discard for that, though. Oh, wait. Maybe I should have kept that. No, wait, I want a pure machine deck for the achievement first, actually, so this is fine. Alright, eight little staples here. Oh, right, uh... Can I... Wait, I don't think I can individually clear the fusion deck, so I'll just do this for a second, no problem. Ooh. No problem, no problem. Viacroid fusion well, is only for via or for uh, roids, though. I can't use it for the cyber dragons. It'll probably be dead in my hand half the time. It's time, chat, for the crusty stuff. Okay, now let's go ahead and sort by card frame. Go down to effects and find cyber. Let's see. Aha! First, we're putting in three of these bad boys. I don't think I have any revives in my deck, like Premature Burial or Call to Haunted. I could use that for sure. Um, we're, We need Proto Cyber Dragon, don't we? Let me see. As for roids, we should put in the basic stuff. What's this do? Opponent cannot select a face of a monster. Okay, that's eh, pretty eh. Why would I use that? It's too weak. Hmm. There's Drilloid. We'll run this at three. Wait, it's earth type? Damn it, roids aren't all light. So maybe I need... Is there a field spell for machines only? That might help. What's the other pieces for Super Jumbo Viacroid? Because that will be funny. Hmm. Roids are a bunch of different types. I don't know if there's a... Is, I don't know if there's a field spell just for machines. Nothing's coming to mind for me. Exploder Dragon. Look for stuff that's new. I have 35 copies of Gate Guardian, chat. What am I gonna do with them? What am I gonna do with them? The answer is not play them. I can tell you that. Wasteland. Ah. I mean, we'd see a different background doing that, I guess. <laughs> Throw the gyroid in there, yeah! Uh, heavy mech support, no thank you. This At the time, this card is selected as in the target of your opponent's attack. Controller this card can activate trap cards from their hand. Um, that's a little too specific. Oh, Jinzo! I forgot, I got that, remember? Um, yeah, let's, let's put Jinzo in the deck. <laughs> Why not? Let's put Jinzo in. He's not a light monster either, but what the hell. Okay, that's Machine King. Mask of Darkness. Pump King. Oh, there's Proto. Run that at three. It has to be on the field, though. So definitely having a revive for that as well would be good. Isn't this? Yeah, Rescue Roid. Roid monster you control, strong but bounce at the graveyard. You can turn that monster to the owner's hand. Be on the field to do that. I don't know. Just put two in for now. 
Will I figure this out? Oh, there's Submarine Roid. Uh, let me see here. It does any battle damage to this card inflicts... Uh, let's see. Well, this card can attack your opponent directly. When it does any battle damage to this card inflicts, your opponent becomes the original attack of this card. You can change this card's defense position at the end of the damage step. Okay. We are burning on that. This is the closest thing to a beat stick we're going to get. We're playing Cyberroids. I don't know why. Pretend it'll work. UFO Roy, don't think I want that. That's just gonna be a brick. Like it usually is. Here's the Thunder Monarch. Hmm. Okay, let's put in Cyber Ends. Because we wanna have fun. Let's put in Cyber Twin, because we still wanna have fun. And Ambulance Rescue Roid. I suppose, yeah, I could run these. I need to put an Ambulance Roid, though, don't I? I need to make sure I get Power Bond and all that in there, too. The goal is to make a stupid fusion and hope it kills them one hit. That's the goal. Steam Roid, Drilloid, Submarine Roid. Yeah. Yeah. Why not? Why not? <laughs> Pretend it'll work. Pretend it'll happen, chat. Should I put in seven completed? I mean, isn't it better? Aren't I just better off putting something else in there, though? <laughs> like, there's a thousand different generic equips. I might as well just put United We Stand on there. United We Stand and Mage Power in the deck for the hell of it. Steam, Gyroid. Sure, we'll pretend we'll summon this for a game. No effect whatsoever. Let me see... Acid Rain. I could check Wasteland. Unironically, I kind of want to do that for the memes. Creature Swap. Mm. I need my Revive, so I need Premature and Call. Oh, Future Fusion. How could I forget about that? Um... Fossil Fusion is there. I need the regular ass fusions, too. Is Heavy Storm in? Yeah, it is. I'm at 28 cards. We still got room. Let me see. Oh, there's limiter removal. It's gonna be funny. Put in a mage power. This is gonna be one of the crustiest things I have ever made, and I'm gonna love it. Oh, MST. Put that in. Hmm. Not overload. Um, should I run one generic poly? I don't know. Because I can also use that for King of the Swamp search effect, right? Which, is it overkill to put Power Bond at three? I'm gonna do it anyway. We can edit this as we go. I promise. Um, don't need Rota. We're playing machines. Oh yeah, I got Scapegoat. Nothing I can do with that in this deck, though. Um... Wait, does Overload Fusion work for Chimera Tech? I thought it was only for Dark Monsters. Dark Machine Monster. Did I not pick Chimera Tech? Apparently I didn't. I'll have to go back up there in a sec. Hold up. And this is Big March of Animals. I got swords in there, don't I? Yes, I do. Yeah, I'm gonna put this in for the memes, too. The big heavy hitting memes chat. Ceasefire. I already got that in there. It doesn't seem... I don't have a copy of Call of the Haunted. I keep forgetting I don't have that. <laughs> I just don't. That's weird. Um, anything else I need here? I got Cylinder in, don't I? Yeah, I do. Hmm. Reckless Greed is there, but I don't know. Put my ring in, maybe? I can always just blow it up if it doesn't work out, right? The extra damage and kill the opponent. Okay. Now, what was the other thing I needed to check? Chimera attack for the fusion deck. Let me go down a bit. Still not there. Chimera Tech, Chimera Tech. Uh. Oh, there it is. It wasn't new. 
I, I must have found it in the dungeon or something. That's why it doesn't have the new symbol on it. Okay, we've done that now. It counts as a dark monster, yeah. Alright, I guess I'll put on Overload Fusion. Let me see. Overload, Overload. I'll try it. This is all new to me, but hey, we're here to learn. So looking at what I have now, I don't think I have enough pieces for some of the fusions, right? Hang on. I've got Rescue Roid. I don't have Ambulance Roid. I need that in. Oh, I don't, I don't have King of the Swamp in here. Oh, of course I got to put King of the Swamp in. Ah, uh, screw the achievement. It's like an extra couple hundred points. We're not getting them all anyway. Hmm. Okay, King of the Swamp, King of the Swamp. What am I doing? There he is. I feel like this sucker needs to be at three in this deck. All right, chat, in your professional Yu-Gi-Oh! player opinion, you know what, I think I can get rid of Lightning Vortex. What card needs to go here? And don't say any of the Roid cards, you fake fans. <laughs> <laughs> I know I need a rescue roid, but I can just use King of the Swamp, which I probably will most of the time anyway. I only have one copy of Submarine Roid anyway. I don't know. Old Man, no. Do you think I could get rid of this? I mean, my strategy is stupid risky anyway. Um, Maybe one less power bond, but it'd be so funny if I could do it. Do I need three of each roid? Not really, I'm just kind of putting stuff in. I suppose I'll just get rid of a gyroid for now. This is gonna be so bad, but we'll make it work. Let's do it. Let's do a few duels with it, and next time we can really explore what this does. Um, change name. Yeah, that's what I want. All right, hang on. Put, call it Cyber. Roids. There we go. Now we're gonna save recipe. And I guess we'll just go all the way down here. Oh, I'm gonna have fun with this. No dest what do I need for a destiny card? I actually don't know what I should put. Maybe just mirror force. No 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 no, don't do that. Don't do that. Let's just put I don't know. Or swords, I guess. Just do something. We got a cat there. Where's students I can train on? What are you doing here? What about you two? Solar assault. Get out of the way. The storm. Heck it, let's go. We got a live one here, yeah? Let's find out. Oof. I'm sure this will go fantastically and we have perfect synergy. You know what I realize we can do, chat? When I can edit Cyrus's deck, you know what I can give him? Cyber Dragons. And it'll get worse. <laughs> now don't blow it. Don't pull an Aster with me. He's going Polly. He's immediately making the Super Jumbo Juicy Drill. That's what it was called, right? Wow! That would take Aster like 50 duels to do that. Oh, you know what I can do, chat? You know what I can do? Watch this. Watch this. <laughs> I can OTK him, can I? Hold up, hold up, hold up. I can bring back... Who's the strongest here? You? This card attacks a monster. Okay, I can just bring back Steamroid then. Yes, I can. And then I can activate Limiter Removal and... Chad, I think I'm gonna have fun playing with Cyrus. I think I'm gonna have fun. <laughs> well! Well, well, well. That Jinzo I found in the dungeon was definitely worth it.
Oh, we're gonna have so we're gonna have so much fun with this. A lot more fun than we did with Heroes, Destiny Heroes. Youch, you're stronger than me. All right, not bad. You know what? Let's, let's try and fight you guys. Go, my angel. All I had to do was go in Crowler's basement a few times. Booze, win! The juicy jumbo drill strategy. Oh, it's the six samurai guy? Uh-oh. I, I may have made a mistake. <laughs> oh, wait, he's got Sakuretsu armor? Damn. All right, then. He actually got his staples. Look at him go. DD Assailant. Okay. Go for it. Go for it, bro. Get Sakuretsu'd. He actually has a lot of traps to protect me from my super strategy. Karma Cut. Oh, there goes that. What? What are you doing? Eva Token. All right, then. What does that do? Uh, when this card's in the graveyard, each time a monster your opponent's side of the field is removed from play, special summon an Eva token. Uh, special summon an Eva token on your side of the field to special summon this card from your hand. Okay. Well, I can just easily beat over it with this. I can't power bond anything in this situation. Oh, I, I think I'm going to have a lot of fun here. Don't need proto here, to be honest. Hmm. Wait, hang on a second. Let me double check something. Hang on a second. Hang on. Does Power Bond have to be your hand? If I just summon this, normal summon this, can I Power Bond into Chimera Tech? Does that really work? If I'm understanding the words right? That wouldn't be enough to kill. Only one way to find out. Hey, 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 hey. All other cards you control to the graveyard means that I'd lose my Ring of Destruction. Then I can do this. Oh. Oh. That's what Wonder Garage is for. Oh. Would that be enough, though? I can't use my Ring of Destruction to finish her off, so it wouldn't be an OTK. Hmm. Uh... Eight, the number of fusion material. The number of fusion materials used for this. Okay. I don't. No, I can't finish her, so it's not worth it to go for it this turn. It's not worth it. I'd just be wide open. So for now, let's just uh, full steam ahead and kill this thing. Pop it. End phase. Play your six samurais. Go ahead. That's right, you're scared. Oh, Cyrus has Snatch Steel? Seriously? Wow. He's got better staples than everyone else we've seen so far. Cyrus has the good back row plays to... Oh, never mind. <laughs> Wonder Garage isn't going off, though. He's got the back row to protect me while I, um... Do my stupid reckless machine stuff. Well. Well. Now we're in trouble. The monster that destroy uh, that this card destroys as a result of battles removed from play. Uh, I can crash into it. This thing will just die, and I'll take all the damage at the end of the damn phase and lose anyway. I'll just do this for now. He needs the staples because his deck sucks, yeah. Ugh. Unfortunately, I'm just going to have to eat crap for it. I got my monsters and fusions, but I don't have my, or my fusion spells, I should say, but I don't have anything to protect myself right now. At least they only had weenie cards to put down. Nothing worth stealing now. 
Ooh, damn. Dark core? Oh, that sucks. Oh, that sucks. Oh, I thought you were bringing the monster out. Wait, what? Why are you playing that thing? Kage Musha of the Blue Flame. All right. Oh, hey, Mage Power. There's my out. Okay. I could put it on Proto and wait to make Cyber Twin if it comes up. Mm. I'm worried about that back row, though. Do this for now. Twister! Well, there goes that. That's fine. Because I'm still strong without it. Better get rid of the token before she uses it to summon that thing. Get jumbo drilled. Or normal size drilled. Hmm. Well, there goes that now. Cyrus, please just use your snatch steel already. Please? Oh, he's gonna fuse those. Wow. Accidental assist with my set poly. Go me. No, no, steal the monster too, please. Uh-oh. You're gonna regret that. You're gonna regret that. Go for the lightnings here now. Uh-oh. Well then. <laughs> oh. I'm going to set this and he's going to have to snatch steal Guilford. That's that's what's going to happen here. Okay, no problem. We got this. I lose attack power, it doesn't matter. Come on, Cyrus, pull it back. He didn't even need the destiny. Come on. He has power bond as his why would you have Power Bond as your destiny card? I mean, it's because of the anime we in that scene, but you're not going to make a comeback with that when you need materials to use that. Come on. That's just... Oh, that's bad. That's a bad thing. Oh, you're out of... Uh-oh. No, no, we can win this. We can win this. Well, now I got the two cybers. Hang on. Let's see... I should be fine to just attack into you for game. Ah. Seven sixty six. That one was a little crusty, but that's okay. We still won. Yeah, let's keep winning. Yeah. All right, Cyrus. Let's go duel with some more chumps. Not you. You two. Risk it all. Middle Ages. You know what? They're both that... You know what? Let's risk it all. Why don't we? I'm playing a gamble pretty much myself anyway. They're both at nine victories. So why the heck not? This is so silly. <laughs> Alright. We're gonna get ready to switch games in a little bit here. Cyberroids, me and my roids, me and my partner here, friend. I hope Paper Lily doesn't take like four hours to finish. It seems I want to say we're at like the last chunk of the game, but I did not have the energy to continue last time. Okay. Okay, what do we have here? Can normal summon you, decoy, de decoy ward. Hang on. Overload fusion works for the graveyard, too. Good to know. Good to know. Hmm. Hmm. Not from the hand, though, of course. Dry Gumo's got that much, though. It's annoying. Hmm, nothing to revive right yet, though, is the issue. 
This thing is annoying because no matter what I set up, he can just pop it with a dice roll. So for now, I'll just put down Steamroid. And we'll go ahead and pop you. Nobody's on board for you, buddy. I don't want to put my whole hand down yet. Because I've been screwed over by that a lot today. Okay, he's going for it. Uh-oh. Hmm. You call the haunted cyber dragon back. This is fine. Not yet. Uh-oh, he flipped it up. What are you doing? I can't believe he didn't go for it. He's putting decoy roid in attack mode. <laughs> oh boy. Well then. Guess he didn't go with it. Well, Cyrus got a free draw. Not bad. That's gonna bleed him dry slightly. Get decoyed. Oh? Does that work? Apparently it does. Well then. Okay, if he's gonna be like that. Hmm. I've got this now, so I... Here's the thing, I can make the Chimera Tech, but the problem is, is the stupid fairy box. I can't... Yeah, no matter what I make, he can just put me at zero attack when I go for it anyway, and then this thing can randomly just pop it if I'm not careful. I need to draw my Heavy Storm before I go into that, right? For now, though, I think it should be safe, since I have to Heavy Storm later anyway. I'll bring out the regular Cyber Dragon. Just as another body to... Never mind. Never mind, everybody. False alarm. Well, made him waste that. Just for now, we can put this down. Hmm. Screw it. Let's go for the attack, then. Go, fairy box. Yeah. Okay, he's gonna play it now. He's bringing out another flying Kamakiri. And I'm gonna do this. Because we know he's gonna go for the decoy. Take that decoy out when we can. Oh, he had to discard. Not bad. Distributing. Hang on. This card... Uh... Okay. That's a pretty annoying thing for him to get on board. Do I want to pay 4,000 life points to stop it? To be honest, I, I do, because once he gets his tribute guys going, it's bad for me. I am going to pay the price. I don't care if I regret it later. I've said no to that before, and I always regret it. Cyrus can save his snatch deal for something better. Is he going for it? He's going for it. Damn. At least he got that 500. He's not going to play anything else. Damn. He lost his poly. Yurai Gumo. Yeah, sure, I'll Destiny draw. Why not? Mirror Force is here. I got Cylinder right there, though. Oh, I don't know if I want to play it. <laughs> if only I could draw my MST or Heavy. Ooh. That's the problem. I'm gonna go for it. Okay. Popped another body on him. Come on, Cyrus. I don't remember if Cyrus has any back row removal. He just seems to have a lot of battle traps. He drew a card. Is he gonna tribute? Nope, he got nothing. He bricked. Is he seriously doing it again? Okay, he actually got it. We could have lost if that went poorly. Close to law, losing. 
<laughs> he's he's really going for it. I shouldn't have fought the gambler. I know how this goes every time. He gave up power bond. Uh oh. Yeah, get beamed. Please, 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 please. No, this is useless when fairy box is there. Hmm. Hmm. That. Do I want to do that? <laughs> ah, there's. No matter what I do, there's always just a big gamble situation here, isn't there? Let me see. 300 on you. This would be enough for game if I won all coin flips. <sighs> Limiter removal would ruin it, though, too. Go for it. Go on, go for it. Risk it all, baby. Where's Jinzo when you need him? You're telling me. Hang on, can I throw down limiter removal when I get, when I win? Ah. Well then. If that's the case. Come on. Not yet. See if I win the coin flip. Hmm. If I do this, I can finish him with the magic cylinder. I'm gonna go for it. I know they're gonna die, but don't worry, I don't care. Alright, we're at zero, two. 1400 be enough? I'm gonna risk it all, baby! I'm not gonna put the swords down. That would just give him time to tribute set up. Come on. Discard from my hand? Of course. Fine. Oh, I gotta place it in such a fickle, annoying way. He bricked again. Cyrus, you can do this. You can do this. You can do this. I believe in you. I believe in you! Come on! I believe in you. I believe in you. <gasps> he did it! He learned to use the Cyber Dragon. All right, I should leave Pierre alone for like ever now. I'm getting tired of him. <laughs> it's so unsafe to use any good cards because he could just pop them and they blow up in my face. Being released, Black Flame, get away from me. Get away from me. To the forest. This is working out so far. Maybe, like, one more duel if I can find someone that's not a dumb opponent. Great Axe, and this guy is... Can I get down there? Ah, oh, whatever. Let's duel these two. Need something? You want to have a duel? Show me what you can do. Heck yeah. At least we're winning. Kind of. Yeah, we are winning. We haven't lost yet. Jinzo would have been so great there if I could just draw him. I kept having bodies on board, but no body to play. Let's do it. Okay, he's got his chumps. At least the Jetroid's got defense. Oh, right, now it's got more defense. Thanks. Uh, good job, dummy. Thanks for doing that. Okay. Well then, we got Premature Burial set. Don't need Proto on the board yet. So we'll do this. And I'll put the Mage Power on the train. The Pain Train, chat. Wanna see him get beamed? He's gonna get super beamed. Yeah, 1950. Keep the jet there, just in case. Save the ring for when we just mess him up. Wow, they got nothing. Cyrus should just play his juicy jumbo drill again. Oh, he's going for game. He's going for game. Go on. Go on. Get him. Flip the ring. Oh. Yeah, he knows what he's doing. He knows what he's doing. 
He's doing actually pretty okay. Curses, I'll be ready for you next time. Surprisingly competent as a partner here, I gotta say. Jaden, that sandwich, that's... I'm gonna bed. See you tomorrow. It's Tuesday. Morning. Let's go get him. What, you're still sleeping? Alright, I think maybe I should make a save here now. Let's do that. Overwrite the data. Yes, save complete. Do it again. He's been surprisingly good, and he had some good draw luck, I have to say. All right, but we're going to take a little break here and then switch over to finish Paper Lily. Oof. I need it. This was a fun Yu-Gi-Oh! session. Uh, too bad Twitch decided to just kind of crap out earlier. Now I have to run this through the editing software to stitch it together. But that's okay. Hope you Glad you guys are still having lots of fun with the Yu-Gi-Oh! streams. I'm still enjoying them a lot. Um, when I can edit his deck, I can give him Jinzo. Oh, you're right. That would be very helpful to us, yeah. I think this is gonna be a really stupid but funny Cyber Dragon deck. We didn't even get to use the Cyber Dragons that much. The Jumbo Drill took him out. Anyways, if you're watching on YouTube, this is where this episode stops for you. We're gonna switch over to a spooky game next, so look forward to more. Have a good night, and bye bye